Hello everyone, welcome back to a literal Fire Emblem Three Houses, literal stat race. We are in a hurry to beat the other enemies from beating each other on the Battle of the Eagle and Lion. And here to help me rush through this monster's ordeal, stat racer himself, Original Raisins. How are you doing? Hey, doing great. Yeah, no, the, the Battle of the Eagle and Lion. One of my favorite chapters, you know, we got all three houses here, probably like one of the more iconic ones in three houses right mm -hmm. like th this is this is like the chapter this is in the trailers i mean maybe maybe it was the other one but i think this was in the trailers maybe yeah, yeah. i uh, think so i i've actually never seen any of the trailers for three houses i think i like i entered the uh oh. fire emblem sphere after this game was like already out oh really so, i didn't know that yeah that's neat yeah yeah like the, the, the community at large yeah, yeah. okay i see <laughs> i meant okay so, so we have a lot to go over in preparations uh first of all we have been uh, hoarding the stat boosters a little bit too much for my convoy. Yeah. <laughs> I just keep forgetting we get them. I'm not consciously putting them in my convoy, but every time I look at them, like, oh, I guess we still have these in the convoy. I should use them sometimes. But whenever I see them, they're like, it's like when I'm in battle checking for other stuff <laughs> and I see these things. Yeah, yeah. Around. So we should distribute these. And I'm also super curious about Raisins' this general strategy for this map because there's a couple things I've noticed about this map. Um, the first thing that I usually like to emphasize for here is that the story and the way the characters talk makes me kind of think that controlling the hill was somehow a big deal. And I guess you do get the ballista and these stairs that reduce the mobility of mounted units, which I guess can help a little bit. But I've always found that like if I'm here, then both enemy groups come at me and start murdering me. And I prefer if they kind of lightly murder each other, but not too much because every time they kill each other, um, they grow towards stat boosts that they get. Um, according to the wiki and various other sources that I have, uh, on manning mode, they get plus two dexterity or a plus two strength, magic, defense, and resistance. Uh, normal mode after five units, hard mode after five units, and then again after defeating eight. And here they get three, five, and eight. So I'd really like to stop that if at all possible. I don't think I can stop them from killing three. Like, that seems really difficult. But if we can do it, if we can win that stat race, I'd be super surprised. So Actually, that'd be kind of crazy. I don't think I've ever done that. I think I've seen it on, like, really well-planned playthroughs. But I think this is a moderately well-planned playthrough, which is my fault, by the way. So I'm, I'm curious, like, mm. how, how how do you generally balance um, like enemy aggro versus wanting to stop their uh, stat increases, raisins? So I do think there is a bit of a manip that the wiki doesn't really mention, where mm -hmm. I think a, a house, like, for example, let's say the Black Eagle house, will get aggroed if on a turn you fight the alliance but don't fight the empire yes so yeah, i think like, that's like how it works right yeah um that's actually a really good point i noticed when i was scarring the wiki as well because i was curious how the ai works because i noticed that if i don't do anything then not a whole lot happens like lorenz rushes the middle and the other like alliance guys kind of follow him but they really mm -hmm. change their tune if you aggro one team like for example um what Claude's AI here says is if any of the Black Eagles, like any of them, even the Cavaliers near the starting point are provoked by a player unit, then they move southwest instead of northwest. So I guess that's towards the Black Eagles. He's like, we're going to sneak mm -hmm. past them. I don't know if he thinks this has captured the flag, but that's what he says he does. Um, and then, for example, like I think Raphael and Ignatz are like a good example. They begin moving mm -hmm. if any of the Black Eagles are provoked by a player unit. So that's when it starts. And then but for the, my, um, yeah. What I'm thinking is that I think this is actually inaccurate and I, i've mm. never i've never actually done this it is begins moving if any of the black eagles are attacked by a player unit mm. and no alliance member was attacked by a player unit on that turn so what i'm saying is actually if you just on each turn make sure you're doing at least one attack for each team simultaneously i think you aggro neither or, or like you, you so kind of like strange. global aggro you actually like global aggro neither huh so interesting so what you're saying i, is... I think I, I i've never i've never done it and we'd have to like you know try it out to confirm but so that makes me want to like go around here somewhere so I can keep attacking one at a time to stop the others from moving. Does that make sense to go like to this, to this place over here? Yeah, yeah, I think I think the idea is you kind of like send a small group over there to like, you know, Ignatz's crew over there. This is like fake Ignatz over yeah, here on the left. Is, that this you're is not Ignatz. Ignat? Ignat? Oh, yes, Ignatz. There you go. <laughs> um, <laughs> there you go. Yeah, um, you send like a small detachment over there who can like and I think, honestly, if they're just kind of scrapping with them over the course of, like, several turns, it's actually pretty fine, mm -hmm. right? Because uh, it'll give the rest of the team uh, the ability to just kind of get wherever they want into the map. Which is the question here, is where do you want to go? Uh, I know you said, like, the central hill as though it's, like, maybe not the best idea, but I don't know. I kind of like getting into center map here. Mm -hmm. 
Well, it is probably the best place to go if you want to kill as many of them as possible. It's just, can you do it safely? That's the main issue. Mm -hmm. And uh, that actually brings up a good point, is getting people where you want them to go. Uh, the formation for this map is like notoriously terrible for stride, and we got oh, a second yeah. stride battalion, but it's B rank, so only Dimitri will be able to use it, and he's using the Dusker Boys, of course, so oh, I yeah, have yeah, two yeah. strides total. I had a couple different ideas for it, but now that you say you kind of want to go around here, maybe it should change a little bit. What my plan was is to, for example, throw Baltus out here, uh, somewhere on, around this bridge, to fight these two Cavaliers. He one rounds them with a the Rapier right now, uh, but like, with the speed he has, it's quite insane. Oh my god. <laughs> he's, a bit, he's a bit too good. <laughs> and the idea there is that you build up a formation behind him that you can stride on turn two instead with everyone closer by. Hmm. And then they can get into the map and, for example, go to the hill or go to the left corner here or the, this left section here. Uh, I flip the map around. Uh, every time I like commentate this map, I usually have it like this. <laughs> and every, mm -hmm. every time there's someone in the comments like, hey, why you have it flipped like this? I always play it flipped like this. So. I'm gonna try to play yeah, it uh, like this. <laughs> it's pretty, I, I was actually see. gonna comment on it like there's two kinds of people. So <laughs> yeah, uh, yes. uh, yeah. No, there, there is a reason for it. I will say is that the LR switch um, does still like 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 it's gonna be backwards because the camera is in reverse. So if there's ever like anyone actually in the comment section wondering like why do you, you always go with like default camera orientation mm -hmm. even on maps where you're going down like this in the next chapter for mm -hmm. example, uh, it's because. And it, usually it's just so that the LR switch is actually going in like the, the quote unquote correct direction. Like mm -hmm. right now, if you put the thing on Balthus and you press R, it'll go to Felix, right? So yes, like it's kind of confusing. Exactly. And um, so my plan was to stride around here, but mm -hmm. on turn two with most units gathered around here, I've stride on Dorothea right now because I feel like she's at least crucial in the early phase and everyone else is like better battalions they want to use for actual combat. But you could also stride with Annette if you prefer or something else. Uh, but if we're going uh, in this direction, I think we might have to change the formation a little bit. Yeah, if we if we're able to send like one guy to the left, uh, who who would that be? If it were to be anybody, who would it be? I feel like the only people who can survive being on their own are Dimitri and Baltus. Hmm. So I think it would be Dimitri because I feel like Baltus is like great for here, but he's also really good against this group, so it doesn't really matter. Uh, yeah, doesn't he one round those caps with the rapier too? I, I think they have the, the same stats. Is, yeah, the reason I want to send Baltus left is just because his deployment slot actually can do it, whereas Dimitri is kind of like forced over on this side of the map. You know, oh, what you're mean? right. You're right. That's fine. So we can like go here depending on what do you want to turn one stride or not? Uh can you get in range of the cabs and Ignace and whatnot? Yeah, I think we might have to give him let's see. He had the march during I... last chapter, so I'm used to him having six move, but uh, I gave it to Bideth this time because she has the inventory space mm -hmm. for it. Uh I, I l let's try the turn two stride. I think we can I think we can do the turn two stride. So maybe we just start with my what my plan is and then figure out if we can improve it from there maybe then? Uh, sure, yeah. Yeah, okay. I'll just keep that in here. Okay, so I guess that means Dorothea's going in the back. Mm -hmm. And let's give us some staff boosters. So I guess I'll make like a backup save from this preps. Uh, we don't need any of these anymore. I'll just put it adjacent. Mm -hmm. You know, actually, you said, um, like, if you don't aggro, then, like, nobody really starts moving at you, right? Mm-hmm. Oh, wait, we can just pull out of aggro and then wheel Dimitri to the left then. Okay, yeah, the, the, the deployment square doesn't matter. Cool. Yeah, I think all that happens if you do nothing is uh, Lawrence is like, ooh, a fortress split and moves forward and then mm -hmm. Bernadette shoots him and then they start fighting a over here. Stronghold for me to <laughs> see. Splendid. <laughs> Bro, should have been Splendid. in my house already. <laughs> Splendid. Okay, I'll just I'll just show you what I got from my ideas, but it might be a little off what I planned because it's a lot yep. of moves to memorize. Uh, let's give them mm -hmm. stat boosters then. So, I think... Dimitri generally doesn't really die, but he will face the most aggro on his own, so I think giving him some defense might be welcome. Alternatively, Byleth, oh, yeah. because she's going to face some of those Pegasus Knights. Like, they just attack her and no one else, so she could probably use some as well. We have, mm -hmm. I think... And one... Brosha is the defense one, right? Uh, I think you're right. Yeah, so this is like plus one defense. That's probably pretty decent on Byleth. She's also surpassed um, advanced bases defense-wise, right? So it's probably best on her. Yeah, yeah. But like, um... Quote, quote unquote optimal time to use these is usually after past advanced bases and i was looking at some of the units that yeah we're totally above mm -hmm. like 17 strength 14 speed 12 defense we're just above that mm -hmm. so. and then the rest is charm res uh, a bunch of luck ones a strength one talisman got it i mean we know what these do i think spirit mm -hmm. dust like the questions asked goes to constance because she can reach one shot thresholds oh there you go sounds fun Let's see that i don't think i have any other magic ones like these are all different things yeah uh, choo, 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 choo. Makes sense. Charm on Yuri because Bath is going to get a lot, and Dimitri's already got plenty of charm too. What about Baltus? Baltus? I don't know. 
I guess it helps him dodge battalions sometimes, but he's only got nine yeah. charms. Like, is he already gonna oh, help? Oh gosh. Ten? Mm. Yeah, it kind of sucks. Um. Yeah, you're kind of right. Yeah, yeah. Char charm Yuri, Charm Dimitri. The other one's good. Okay. We'll, we'll roll with the golden apple then. It's one level. Wait, was this SOV? <laughs> uh, all right. Uh, so for Rez, we don't really have a great. Rez is always like hard to allocate. Yeah, it's yeah. like who's this go to? We don't have a great uh, mage killer, uh, but I suppose if it was someone, it'd be like someone who could use a bow or something, right? Or someone who's like good one to range kind of. I suppose Byron mm -hmm. would be decent. I suppose that Yuri would be decent. Felix. People who have like some semblance of bulk that can kind of convert that into taking a lot of hits from mages, I guess. Yeah, if they have like good HP as well. Yeah, I like doing that. Yeah, so that's not Fila <laughs> that's not uh, Yuri. So I guess we'll throw it on Byleth or. Yeah, no. I guess Byleth is like. By Byleth's a good choice here. Yeah. yeah, I'll give her some Verona. Here you go. Finally, the intervention. We're cleaning up the stat boosters. This yes. does happen to me too. Where like. <laughs> You know, every time I scroll mm -hmm. past a stab booster cabinet, I was just already doing something like more important. Yes, exactly, <laughs> like... exactly. Uh, I guess some energy drop on Felix would be pretty good just to keep him like, because he's doubling, so it would be pretty good to just have him do two extra damage every time. Oh yeah, he is fast. He like is fast boy. <laughs> I better get these weapons back, by the way. I keep forgetting what I'm depositing. Thunderbrand. Oh yeah. Load some strength on him. Oh yeah, it was Thunderbrand, yeah. The goddess icon I usually don't mind like on Dimitri universally, right? Mm -hmm. Um just because he his luck is like pretty low and as much as I like clown on the luck stat, it's pretty good to not be at like, you know, two luck. So I'll give him some more uh, lucky things. If nothing else, it can help in chapter thirteen. That's true. This is luck too, right? Miracle Beam. Yep. That's right. I'll load him up. How many lances do we have anyway? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Get rid of this lance of rune and short spear. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, Lancer Rune is a nice nuke option, especially if he's going to be on his own. I feel like it's pretty good on this in this chapter. Oh, yeah. I, I, I meant, like, just, just for the moment, as we're, like, oh, you know, yeah, point yeah, establishes yeah. the combo. Yeah, yeah. I can only remember one thing at a time. Right. Oh, true, true, true. I'm loading all the luck on him. He's my lucky boy. There we go. Um, Who gets the speed wing? That's a good question. Uh, I mean, is Byleth going to qualify for, like, anything fast enough to take advantage of 17 speed? Uh, uh, I think Felix is fast enough. I feel like the mages don't really double enough. The dude doesn't need it with vengeance. I guess Balthus is pretty good with Speedwing. Yeah, Balthus is kind of like going in actually. Look at the, holy crap! Wait, what? Sixteen? Yeah, he's Sheesh. fast, boy. I think. Chill wait, out, dude. Does he have speed plus two? No, right? No, he doesn't. No, nope. is good. This is just thief circle. Oh yeah, I've, here's the thief. Mm -hmm. Two speed, but you know, like that's it. <laughs> uh huh. Sheesh, this guy's like going. Holy crap! I guess it okay. could be like. Uh, I think we can give it to him. Every time we double something, dies. So it seems kind of good to, to good to me. Speed wing. Nice, nice. And I guess might as well make him hit stuff. Him too, yeah, sure. I gave him that hand axe, he's gonna need it. And that leaves the talisman. I guess Byleth is like decent for that too. Yeah, I like it. Alright. Stop hoarding, chat. Stop hoarding. Okay. Alright, oh. we've done it. Nice. Okay, give you back the sword of the creator. Give you back what I take off of him again. Oh, I can't remember. <laughs> Same. <laughs> Uh, Pure shield. water, iron I don't know, shield. maybe. Iron oh, iron, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course, of course. Uh, Felix had Thunderbrand. Yep, Got that, that looks good. What's your mark? Baltus Volm. Sure. Perfect Mundo. And I think he had Volm too. Uh, yeah, yeah looking he perfect. A he has a Volm. Yeah, he has a Pure Water. Woo. Bought some Pure Waters. Okay, we got Flane as an adjutant for Byleth to do some extra damage because I didn't really see a better use for the slot. Mm -hmm. And uh, Ingrid for Felix as usual. Okay, so I'll show you my turn one plan, and we'll see if we can improve it a little bit from there. Yeah, let's see it. Uh, I don't really like it very much, but it is what I've got. The battle of mm -hmm. the eagle and lion is set to begin at long last. Remember, we're not just fighting for honor. There's a prize at stake. It's almost time to begin. Steal yourselves, everyone. This is definitely an traitor. Oh, this one, yeah. You all should know. I am not about to go easy on you today. As long as we can pull off the win, it doesn't matter how. Our victory must be absolute, no matter what it may take.
ambiguous Byleth allegiance. <laughs> Forward, <now. laughs> I just noticed that, yeah. <laughs> It's okay, guys. They're not fighting for realsies. All right. You're in a reward if you defeat more enemies than other classes. Hurry up and defeat enemies before the other classes start fighting each other. Since it's a practice battle, units who are defeated will not be permanently lost. Okay, let's uh, take those words to heart. And we have... Oh, I can't define pulse before I made a move. I was like trying to check how many I had total now. I think it's five. Wait, really? You can't? No, I can't. I'm, I'm matching oh, as hard that's as fine. I can. I never tried. <laughs> so, <laughs> so the further you put Baltus, the further uh, in I have to strike with Dorothea next turn. And if I put him, like mm -hmm. for example, here, I have to strike this unit here in order to strike Baltus. So I think putting him on the bridge and then striding like a unit here gives me the most flexibility on the turn to stride. Mm -hmm. So for now, I'll just throw him here. Uh, yeah, it also like doesn't remove a bunch of the striding squares with water, right? So you can kind of like pack everybody in there if you want. Yeah, uh, it, it is kind of fun that you can kind of stride across water. Like you can put like Byleth here, for example, or I had like a turn three stride that had like someone stride with someone that's in here and then that hits someone here, for example. So yeah, yeah. There's some little tricks you can do. That's my cue. So I think Dorothea should. Does she has a full move. One, two, three, four. So she's trying to be the person that is here or here. So she doesn't have mm -hmm. to move full. So you can be like in whatever square. Uh, something fancy I was trying to do is make Bernadetta attack the do, do, which she kind of seems to want to do. But the moment mm -hmm. you put a mage in that square, uh, she yep. goes for that mage instead. Uh, so I guess my question to you is, do you think it's important enough to... Like, I feel like we want to strike the mage's turn too as well. I think it would be nice to not have to strike twice to get all the mages involved. So I think it's... Mm -hmm. We could just delay the do's vengeance setup for later. Well, we have a square southwest of Balthus that can be, like, the target of the stride, right? So we can still pack all the mages around, it looks like. So Happy mm. can go, like, east of Dorothea and then, you know, say Annette southwest of that and Constant southwest of that. And we still have that stride. Oh, uh, well, apparently not, but, you know. Wait, what? Constant, Constant does work. Uh, did it do something wrong? Uh, no, but it's fine. Annette's, like, doesn't need to go super far anyway because she's rallying. Okay, so I, I guess yeah. we'll do something wrong. All right, let's just go here. There you go. Yes. There go. Nice. And uh, so we're striding here, this person. Mm -hmm. So I guess that can be the do or something. I don't know. A do. Sure thing. Yuri, Sounds like a good start. Something like here. Wait, is he in range of something? Oh, is this uh, the ballista. That's the ballista. Okay, that's fine. Maybe Gauntless raises his avoid. I don't know. Oh, uh, he doesn't have prowess. I mean, he doesn't. Yeah, he doesn't have prowess. And Dimitri can go further forward, but I think they'd like to target him sometimes. I'd rather they go for Baltus to get one-rounded, so we'll go... Let's see, we're trying Dimitri, so you can go here. Yeah, I think Dudu is going to be the one who, like, actually catches the stride, so... Yes. Get you behind here, then. Ooh, we even have a shove. That's cool. Uh, swap. Or swap. <laughs> I put swap on him it's and cute. on uh, Dimitri. For funnies. I have some... Uh, oh, that's kind of good, actually. I have some combat arts, yeah. They're a little different than before, so you might not be used to what we have available. Mm -hmm. So let's flash those. Diamond right axe. Yeah. <laughs> I know. I was like, all right, we have a hand axe. We might as well have that as an option. I never, I've never used the fist ones anyway. Okay, yeah. It looks like she would like to ballista Byleth if I'm mount, if I'm flying. And I've noticed that even if I take off the mounts, she still goes for her. So. Oh really? Yeah. I'm not sure. Not She's sure going for Yuri right now, right? So you know. Yeah, it doesn't matter at this point, I guess. So I suppose I'll just like put Byleth. I don't want to go on the river because then I get attacked by the calves. So I think I'll just go here, dismount. And chill for a turn. Sounds good to me. All right, let's see how it works out. Huh. Still Yuri, nice. Yeah. Huh. One percent crit dies. <laughs> yeah. No. Okay, here comes Baltus. <laughs> I am a little short on smithing stones, or I would have repaired to ra or fourth rapier to rapier plus, but uh, I only had like five left or something. Uh. Black eagles and blue lions are fighting. Me? So that's the global aggro, I think, for the golden deer. Yeah, so on this turn, they checked if you fought the Empire and not them, and if so, then they global aggro. Mm -hmm. But that are like permanently global aggro, right? Yes, yeah. it will never switch off. Yeah, and I think that sucks, but we can keep trying, I guess. Because mm -hmm. now the idea would be that we stride Dadu. Yep. And I think, um... Yeah, if we, like, stay out of range and maybe, like, send Dimitri over there 
like first, then I think this works. Is, is there anyone in the Black Eagles who is just aggroed straight away? Uh, Black Eagles? No, I don't, I don't think, think so. so. Right? Like, I've uh, what I what I did to experiment is like to stay out of range of everything, uh, easing the blister, and with nothing mm -hmm. would move from the Black Eagles. <laughs> nothing. But another oh, would wow. like shoot Norns, and that's it. Yeah, uh, I mean, this is fine. This is usually the position I end up in, and yeah, like, I turn to just kind of, like, stride in. Mm -hmm. Okay. Take the hill. As long as it's what you do. So I've noticed that Felix had a one round with an Annette Rally on Bernadetta that we can do. Um, mm. I think with Steel Ball, maybe he gets it even now. Yeah. That... Can you do it with Gauntlets? Uh, curiously. Oh, wow, wait, Steel Ball just does it. Okay, yeah, yeah there's Steel that too. It. It's probably better to use Gauntlets, because Bernadetta doesn't counter at close range. She's all Lumbo equipped, so we could do punch her in the face, get rid of her. Mm -hmm. I don't know if that's important. Like, do we, do we try to like conquer the central hill then? See if we can take advantage of that. Uh, yeah, yeah. I mean, I, I kind of would like to just get as far into the map as I can, right? Mm -hmm. So, central hill seems like a good starting point for that. Sure. Uh, we we can put Byleth on the Pegasus too to see like what is our what is our actual movement, right? Oh, good idea. With this unit, it's pretty far. Uh, I don't know if she can one round Bernie, but like we have Felix for that, so I guess it doesn't matter. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we can't do that. Uh, I think at some point, Byleth is like, we're going to have this group aggro at us soonish, I think. And I think so as well, this yeah. This is Ferdinand, and then these Pegasi will only attack Byleth. So what might end up happening is this guy can't get access to us because of the stairs. And because of that, we kind of negate that whole problem because we just put oh, Byleth true. in the forest here. And um, she just fights the Pegasi on our own. Maybe some help from the guys with bows. And... The Pegas the, by the time the cavalry gets to us, the Pegasi are gone, and the biggest danger is just, like, past. Oh, yeah, no, that totally makes sense. And maybe we gather on the central hill, set up for a second stride into here somewhere to stop them from killing each other. Because if they kill each other too much, then we get all the stat boosts to deal with. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, I guess what we can do is, like, we probably aren't going to end up killing these on this player phase. Like, they're just too far away. Maybe we just mm -hmm. put Baltus in their range. Kill this... If we kill this one cav... And put Baltus in range of these two guys. They will both suicide on Baltus. That seems pretty good to mm -hmm. me. Yeah, yeah. I think uh, we can get an extra point of movement with, like, say, a happy drawback, right? Which I know is like not really using the most of Happy's movement, but uh, uh, or or we could use say a Dimitri swap. Could always work too. I think the Dimitri swap has my appeal because, like, I think if if you stay behind at this point here, the only way you're ever going to catch up with the is with the second stride. And I think that's kind of leaves Dorothy out of the equation completely, which <laughs> would be disappointing after all we've been through together. <laughs> Yeah, I totally agree. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so let's say we we start rolling with this and see what happens. So we could gauntlet mm -hmm. Bernie. Roll with the punches. <laughs> yeah, roll with the punches. <laughs> Sorry, Bernie. Why am I see you. <laughs> <laughs> Don't need that. You're a thief anyway. Okay. I guess we can uh, you can use this as an opportunity to get vengeance going. If you just oh, true. for like no reason. This is pretty good. I guess what? This is heavier, I guess. Okay. Dang, to do too fast? <laughs> okay, this is not enough to get one shots on everything with the train lance, but it's a, it's a start. And then we we're gonna swap Baltus with Dimi, Tree. So I think so, yeah. Tree can finish and... this guy. Surely, yep, okay, gone. Let's yeah, yeah, it. nice, nice. Uh, totally. Let's see. What's he got? Like, which pat? He's got the Knights of Zeros. Nice, nice. Yeah, I really wanted him to use the second strike gambit, but he can he cannot do it yet. Uh, I'm trying. Yeah, to... it's just a bit far out. Oh, yes. Dang. Oh, I supposed to record with raisins apparently in half an hour. Uh... No. <laughs> <laughs> not near an ally. Does that mean just not adjacent? Uh yeah, not adjacent. Okay, it, so there doesn't be no ally adjacent relation to do. Okay, so I guess I'll just like yes. Hey, we'll we have healing available anyway. Uh, uh. Yeah, yeah, we can take a 12. Yeah. Crest That's fine. Alban. Who's next? Yeah, or we could have got the cancel from the Crest of Obama, but apparently <laughs> didn't want that. Never be satisfied. Thirsty. Thirsty as fuck. Okay. Whoa. Uh, Balt has got some damage on him. That's probably fine to keep there. So we're changing the swap. Uh, we want to kill that one more cab, right? Mm -hmm. So I guess that's like, buy that swap, either that or like we do it with uh, Baltus after. Sure. Yeah, just like we can. Hmm. This is where Baltus weakens again so that he can get into King of Grappling range. I guess it's not very crucial for this phase that he gets that. He's taking yeah, sure. I guess it'll be in like range of the other horses too, which is pretty fine. Yeah, actually. that's what I want. That's what I want. Yeah, that's what we're, that's what we're going for. Uh, in fact, sure I guess we don't need to Ignatz swap Ignatz moves for the calves. So. Uh, Fake Ignatz, alright. Alliance General. 
yeah. he's before the Cavs. So. so is that bad for us? I guess he only has 12 speeds. So he's not going to double us or anything. He has it's like pretty good. He has a steel skill, though. Seal speed yeah. for Balthus. Yeah, that doesn't seem great, getting sealed before the enemy Cavs attack, right? He'll put him straight in King of Grappling range, and then also Poison Strike. The Poison Strike is going to do 8, plus however much his bow is, and then the Cavs are going to do 8. So 16. Does he do 15 with his bow? Because if not, then we survive. Well, I'm more worried about his ability to kill the Cavs with counterattack, but uh, 28 attack. Oh, true. Do we just kill even through the seal speed? Attack, 17 damage. Uh, I mean, we have 17 AS, yeah. So mm -hmm. it's sealed, that's minus 6, right? So that's 11. I guess we don't kill, yeah. I mean, we have plenty of people rally. to him off, I guess. Uh, I guess I, I guess I can rally him. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, I don't, I don't Yeah, I could, that seems like a good easy to turn, actually, for our nets. Thanks, pal. Thanks, pal. I guess I'll do this just to see more options and get on the hill. Mm -hmm. Okay, I guess he doesn't get there right away. Yeah, yeah. All right, whatever. Just try it and see what happens. Richter <laughs> nearly like one shotting here. <laughs> oh yeah, the enemies have like insane skill load on this map. I forgot to highlight that earlier. Like this guy, Swordbreaker. I think about some of our enemies had like Swordbreaker Plus even. Oh yeah, this is a Swordbreaker Plus. Yeah, yeah. Plus yeah, I think we're the avoid. we're the time where like you know all the calves are gonna have Swordbreaker Plus from here on out. Okay. So, and then we have the advanced Pegasi on the right. You've seen these guys, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. These are insane. They're like the illegal uh, Pegasus. They're like <laughs> the, the enemy only advanced Pegasi or something. Well, not advanced. Yeah, yet. seven. Yeah, advanced fair seven move. Like, okay, <laughs> <What the laughs> sure. Fuck is this bullshit, dude? Like everything that's supposed to be bad about Pegasus night, they have fixed with the skill loadout. Yeah, no. Sure, have weight minus three as well. The, they learned from Blazing Blade, I guess. <laughs> I guess so. Uh, does it matter where Poop is right now? Not really, right? Uh, yeah. No, I guess like as central as possible. That's the only thing I yeah. would care about. Somewhere where she can be in range of the Pegasi at the, at the right side later. Yep, yep. Alright. Can't do a lot of important healing right now. I guess I can get a ward on Happy if I go, like, here. And, yeah, if you, like, Physic Gear, you can ward Happy. Yeah, sure. Yeah. yeah, this all makes sense to me. And the mages are, like, really far in now, too. Perfect. Yeah, I mean, not as far as I would have liked. I don't think I get to attack anything next turn, but it's as good as it gets, I guess. Mm. For now. There's Ferdinand. I'm kind of curious where these Pegasi are going to go. Okay, it's unclear. A stronghold for me to seize. Splendid. <laughs> Splendid. <laughs> Love this guy. <laughs> there goes Lawrence acting on his own. Guess we've got no choice but to capture the central hill and cover it. All right, Raphael's going in. They only can mm -hmm. move south here, right? I think she did that for me when I was testing. Come here. Come I here. think so. Come here. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> oh, we're facing a crit right here. What the heck? Yeah, we could have got owned by crit, I guess, huh? Uh -huh. Do we dodge the seal now? Yeah, we do. Nice. Okay. Oh, yeah, we do. Okay. Well, these cabs were like dead. Dead, so, dead. Yeah. Well, we calculated like with rally speed, they were dead, dead. Anyway. What the fuck, Balthus? It's gonna crit. No, what? It's mm -hmm. gonna kind of... cringe. Can't tell away, please. Uh, yeah, I hope he has movement left. Yeah, no. Okay, go away, go away. This is the real away. reason to move further Thank in. You. There we go. Shoot, nice, shoot, nice, shoot, nice. Shoot. Open up the square. One shot. Stat raise. One. Holy shit. Boom. Save the rapier use. Okay, that makes sense, yeah. Okay, How many are left? Okay, so we... For, uh, yeah. Is this, I think this is all you can do is like short spear by left. Okay, that's great. That's excellent. Wow. Not. Okay. So Look at this guy. Can we just like get him for free, actually? Mm-hmm. Oh, almost. I guess with... Oh, the, nearly there. Yeah, with the... <laughs> Not either there? <laughs> Not nearer? No, no, no. <laughs> yeah, if you had the Lands of Ruin, you could get there. Uh, it's on the meat tree right now, so it's not great to trade it off right now. It's okay. Mm. We don't have to kill him right now. We can, uh... If you have nothing to do for Byleth, we can always, like, Iron Bow, Canto away, and then kill him. Mm -hmm. but... I think there is something to do with Byleth, though, seeing as he's Pegasi or, like, in our camp right now, you know? Yeah. Like... Um, so they don't double Byleth right now. For... Oh, what the heck? Oh, you can't reach Byleth, so you go for someone else. That makes sense. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so we want Byleth to end up within their ranges, no matter what we do. Uh, but we could just like attack them for free with units here. Like they're they're gonna just get ignored. So it's like a, it would be a good place for the mages to do anything, if not for the fact that these are Pegasus knights. Oh yeah, and they have like a gazillion res. You know, Constance like probably thumps them anyway, doesn't she? What? Does she have a bunch of damage? Well, no, but oh, she does do a lot of damage, especially after the yeah. spirit dusts. True, 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 true. We can do that. 
Um, we probably want to heal Bob because we still use his turn. So I'm thinking if a Physic is wise here. I'm going to check that. Uh, that's not ideal. But yeah, I've seen better for sure. <laughs> let's see. Cast they have like Gambits, right, is the main thing? Yeah. Uh, well, the ones that are like either classmates or replacements of classmates of Gambits, but the generic ones do not. So we probably want to... Oh gosh, like everyone's here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, everybody's here. I mean, that's, that's that's good, right? I think... Dimitri can't get very far because the stairs... Uh, it's like the drawback of putting... I guess we can dismount, but then we can't mount him again. Mm -hmm. It's not great. Yeah, dismount gives you like a little bit of extra movement this turn. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to find a offensive position for Laura, for him to just like start killing. Mm -hmm. I'm wondering if we can get away with something like physic him, kill the archer, or like maybe do that afterwards. Because if you lose, no, he still gets it with King of Grappling disabled, so that's that order doesn't matter a whole lot. Mm -hmm. He can't get very far. Maybe just like have Baltus and Dimitri side by side here and see what happens. I'm assuming that like if I heal Baltus, they're gonna start gambiting him. Yeah, I think like the only reason they're not gaining right now is because they just see lethal with their weapons, yes. right? So that's what I think too. How does Baltus do against Leone right now? Oh gosh, we quad her. Okay, nice. Surely he doesn't double. <laughs> no way he doubles, right? Okay, he doesn't. She's very fast. We're... Yeah. Could have recruited her to prevent this. Um if we don't, if we disable King of Grappling, there's going to be a lot more damage on us. But I think he can live this whole group if he wants to. Just a matter of, mm -hmm. I guess maybe if he gets gambited, he might not. Um... Yeah, and the gambit, like I don't know how much charm, like say Lorenz or Leone have. Like they're not really known for having super high charm mm -hmm. normally. But okay, I guess Leone does. Lot. We could. Yeah, he I doesn't don't. have an equipment right now, so we could pull out the brooch with like Happy trade over with someone else to him. Then he gets mm -hmm. 19 charm, which makes their gambits fairly ac inaccurate to me, right? Like, Lawrence probably won't hit his, probably. Uh, will it be 19 charm, really? Wait, what's his charm right now? It's 14? He has no uh, the brooch goes up to 16, right? So oh, it's, it's not, not like... plus 5, I'm dumb. Okay, never mind. Yeah, yeah, it's plus 4. Or plus 2, rather. Mm -hmm. We'll say, like, all the numbers until we get it correct. Like... <laughs> I mean, it, what's, yeah, what's the... the alternative to having him uh, tank side-by-side -side with Dimitri here? Is there a better option? Let's see. Uh... A bunch of the enemies here are calves, so if we kind of like go here, yeah. If we just kind of like use the stairs here, I'm wondering if there's like a way we can chain use the ballista with our Kanto units, oh. just like kill. <laughs> uh, it takes D or higher, which Bada does not have. Felix can use it for sure. Mm -hmm. He's got the bow rank. I don't think no. I don't think we train a bow rank on a whole lot of other people. I guess he's got D, so he could be one of them. But we don't have. Yeah, I'm wondering like, yeah, yeah. But I could ballista this cab, I guess, if you wanted want to finish him off, but I feel like that's like pretty trivial. Yeah, I was thinking like leave the Cavaliers just because like it's gonna be hard for them to get onto the hill, but like Ig Ignaz can get onto the hill really easily. Mm -hmm. So I kinda wanted to like run but kill Ignaz at the same time. Well Another thing we can do is just sack Balthus. Like we can just run up here and have him like, you know, kill Ignaz and then, you know, cross our fingers. I feel like while he's we... Pretty good for the rest of the battle though. <laughs> yeah, he's like kinda really good. I know it's not a firmer death. I think I just want to see what happens if he just goes, maybe not in in. Um, maybe if we bait this uh, Ignatz clone with someone else behind the scenes here, so that he doesn't go for Baltus. With like hmm. uh, maybe not Felix, but like Yuri. Yeah, if we run with everybody, or like by run, I mean you know attack the Empire, of course. <laughs> um, then I think only Ignatz will still be in range. True. So everyone will move like really slowly. Mm -hmm. Like, there's no reason not to fight them now a little bit, right? Oh, what if, oh, what if Baltus is like moves back one and heals? And he's in a really good HP position. Like, what if he just goes here, for example? And like concoctions? Yeah, I was thinking Vaughn because concoction would put him out of King of Grappling. True. I kind of want to see if he lives this. Kind of like him. What if he even goes. If he goes to Jason to Violet right now, he can get the Brooch. Eh. I'll just see what happens here. Yeah. How are, we, how are we dealing with the Pegasi, actually? Like, what, what's, the, what's the plan for these guys? I think... Since the Duke can't reach... I think we can throw the mages at them. Oh, we can't actually throw the, throw them at them, because this Cavalier will get them, or the not. Yeah, yeah. So... We need, like, the second one to be, I don't know, like, Byleth with uh, something. 
Or Yuri with a steel bow even could do it. Yeah, I think we can always just do this. Just throw Byleth here, dismounts, equip something funny like Iron Lance to still avoid Swordbreaker Plus. And uh, she'll tank them no problem, especially after we gave her some stat boosters just now. So, and then we can even have Yuri come in to uh, chip them a little bit for free. Like He's not going to get mm -hmm. attacked anyway, so it's like curved shot for like after HP. He can steel bow, right? I think we. I don't know where the steel bow is. I have it on but Felix, I'm afraid. I think we got one. Yeah. Oh, okay. I think it's my only one. Yeah, it's my only one, I'm afraid. Um, hmm. But we can do, like, Constance plus Yuri to kill one, and then there's only one left. It seems pretty reasonable. Like, I don't think they're a big threat because they will just perpetually keep attacking Byleth anyway, so. I think every other enemy is more, more important than them. Oh yeah, true. They just aggro Byleth over mm -hmm. everyone else. Yeah, you're totally right. Okay. Uh, mm -hmm. We can bring Byleth over here instead and rally her too, but I think the forest is just makes more sense. Uh, we can even yeah, like, I agree. Go here, bow. Can't, oh, we can't uh, this one after Canto. So I think we just go here. Yeah, screw it. I'm just gonna go into forest and vibe with the uh, chill with the lance. Yeah, I think with the so. Lance. Yeah, it makes sense. She got too used to it. We did lose three speed from that, so did the Pegasus head double now, or no? A little bit. Okay. Maybe a little bit. They need to hit, like, quad 40s to be successful here, I guess. Yeah. I mean, maybe if she kills on a counterattack with 30 attack, 14. So if we do enough damage to them, they will die. Like, one of them oh, will true. die, so they don't get the double. Uh, Dead Eye is more damage, right? Ooh. Yes. Oh. Uh, well, if, oh, if, if we hit. Isn't it, like, three range? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I guess it's three to five range. Okay, that's pretty, that's pretty not Yeah, bad, it's like kind of bad. <laughs> kind of cringe, actually. Curve shot it is. Yeah, a lot better. There we go. <laughs> 94, we'll take it. Yeah, that's enough damage for, for Bias to kill him on a counter. That will get rid of him. Can't do a whole lot with this rally. I think I'll just move full move with Annette instead. Maybe. I think so as well. Do we, we like can... try to kill Ignatz here anyway? Seems he right now he wants to attack Felix, but that's probably because he has gauntlets equipped. Nope, he's still going for it. Well, he's got the three range and Felix doesn't, right? So. Oh, true. He's not an archer. He's just pretending to be one. Mm -hmm. Well, if he's if he's attacking at three range, I'm not afraid of him. <laughs> Let me put it that way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I guess we could hit him. He, he's still like, in my opinion, one of the like kind of trickier guys to deal with, because the other ones we can just like run if we need. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'll just hit Ignatz, and then if he wants to go for Felix, he has to get so close that we can kill him with like anyone here, I think. Sure, sure. And uh, the rest of the guys, like he's he's oh he's short spearing. That makes sense. Oh, true. Uh huh. So ten, four, and four. That Looks is a kill. Kind of like he's a hundred percent dead here. <laughs> like <laughs> kind of. Uh, I can heal with Happy, I guess. Uh, the more HP that? is like usually better here as long as you're healing at least six it's like always better even with king of grappling math right so i guess so if, if one spot if one hit knocks you into the range uh what's the other like Nat's range mm -hmm. okay i guess i'll go here with happy then Izik, baltus i guess a concoction would have been better but he didn't have one on him so i didn't really have that option mm -hmm. okay and uh i think it might have been better to ballista him so that next turn the duke could just like attack for free but oh, true, true. We have more attacks on the thing, but if we have the Divine Pulse, we can always fix that. Yeah, that, that attack, the Ballista you were showing onto Ferdinand was like way better, yeah. Just run here, I guess. Do a free ward. Move full. Let's see. I guess. If, there, if like, nobody's going for Dimitri, how, like, deep into enemy territory can we get him while, like, still not being under attack? Uh, which enemy territory are we talking? Like left or right? Uh, let's try Alliance. So left, okay. I mean, they still like to go for Baldus because he's low, so I guess he can go wherever he wants, really. Yeah, it sounds good. Sounds good. Uh, I guess Monting is better here, then. What okay. if we put him in front of Baldus here, actually? Uh -huh. The only does have Night Leader, but I don't think it kills him. <laughs> oh, sure. Well, if he's dismounted, it definitely won't kill, right? Yeah, but uh, I to move here, I need my mounts. Yeah. Well, I was trying to like, dismount to maybe like, north oh. or west of Balthus, either one, right? Oh, I guess, yeah. It looks like they still all want to go for Balthus for some reason, so sure. Mm -hmm. Dismount or...? Yeah. I mean, if they attack him... I don't know. Or like, like, dismount first for extra move and then go. 
Oh, sure. I like it. And I don't remember what he needs to use, but surely Iron Sword is not the answer. I think Short Spear, probably. It's the strongest thing you can counter with. Yeah, Short Spear or Training Lance, one of those two. Okay. Probably good. And he holds it like a sword, but you know. <laughs> I wonder if we can the Short Spear. This. Can we tank this? It's the oh, huh. one. With um, the do I mean? 31. No, 16. He falls, yeah, no. And he gets doubled for sure. I don't think there's a way. Actually, he, if he waits, he gets plus four prod. Hold up. So we'll go to 19. 19 is 12, 12, 12. times 2. So if we get doubled with a short spear, then we go into. Like, if we, and we Vuln now. But Vuln isn't waiting, right? So Can we, like. Yeah, Vuln is waiting. Can we training lights? Vuln is 10 and waiting is 8. So, like, if we need to. Or can we, like, yeah, can we get above the doubling threshold? Nine. Oh, that 12? is above. Oh, it, we yeah. don't get doubled. Okay, nice. Okay, so just don't get any kills for them, I guess. So yeah. now we don't get doubled, so now we're just taking 12. That's good, right? Well, we need to go east of Felix if we're going to do this, because we need to be not in range of Ignats. Oh, yeah. Ignats of range is quite yeah. big. Big Nats, if you will. Ooh. All right, just don't get crit. Just don't get crit, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, nice uh, rectangular javelin. Okay, now we can definitely kill him with defenses without any help. So what I did was optimal. Watch oh, and true. learn. Watch Everyone's and learn. missing. Nice. Okay. Watch and learn. Yo. This is the strat. Practice yields results. Okay. I think our battalion's max level anyway, so I don't regret not making space for that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, this one is dead. If you miss, watch and learn. Watch and learn. Battle, Ooh. A chance to grow. A chance to grow. Actually, it's only when you level up. There's Lawrence. Hmm. I'm You're right. skeptical of this. What about HP? What about it? There's a chance to grow HP each battle. That's true. Would it help here? Because the Crest of Flames. Oh, with Pilot, you mean? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> grow HP. All right, I see, I see, I see. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, Hilda took a really dumb position. Oh. Uh, we're kind of dead. We're kind of dead. We're getting dead. Chicken Nine Healer? Yeah. I didn't notice that. Okay. Yeah. All right. Rude. It's not dead. Don't Canto. You can't Canto. You you're, you're, you're have to move. Okay. Ignat misses. You're stuck in place. Ignat misses. Oh! <laughs> it's that Hip simple. Plus 20, fellas. but that skill. This has there got to go. be the best argument you have ever seen against Hit Plus, uh, against hit plus 20 being bad. Because, oh, sure, yeah. You saw that coming. Remove it from Ignatz and Balthus, di Balthus dodges the 79. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Noob. That actually did work. I can't it believe did. it. Okay. It's insane. <laughs> okay. Was he, to... Wait, was, was someone sealed or what? Does Balthus have a debuff? Doesn't look like it. I feel like uh, because the Ignat's missed, no one else here has a seal, right? I guess yeah, there's like a down arrow appearing on his icon, though. I wonder. On, ba on Balthus? Yeah. Like below him, there's like the blue arrow and the down arrow. I wonder. Oh, oh, someone hit him with the seal strength. It was Lawrence. Lawrence has seal strength. Okay. Oh, <laughs> it negates King of Grappling. <laughs> so yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Did he? Did he what? Is Lawrence dead? He's dead, right? Yeah, we killed one. Okay, good. I think we one shot him. Okay. Or no, we, we just doubled him on the counter and then killed him. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's see vengeance here. So that would be very easy if it just killed. It is very easy. Oh my gosh. Do 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 do. Easy. Okay. How? I guess the question here is, how many will it take to kill slash negate all this, and then can we dedicate our resources to like pulling these guys towards us instead? Yeah, can we move north? Because uh, Raphael has nobody in range, so... It would be an ideal turn to pull him, for sure. If we give him somebody to fight, he will fight. Yes. And it's preferably someone he doesn't kill. Uh, 30 attack is going to do a number on people, but it will not kill Felix in one round. Are we fast enough to get doubled? Are we fast enough yeah. to double? Yeah, well, we're, we're like one off of doubling, I think. Are we yeah. sure? Well, we what about Iron Gauntlet? We have other weapons, yeah. yeah. Or even... Hmm. Let's see, 20 oh wait, wait, we have weight minus three, right? Ah, oh, dang it. Um, I mean, is that bad? Oh, well, I, I was like expecting the speed to go oh. up when we like equipped gauntlet or something. Is yeah, anything. no, no, we have to yeah. speed. Yes, 18 AS. I think without a net, there's no way, and then we'd have to strive to get that. We yeah. could do that, but I don't think it's great considering we just want to pull him. We don't necessarily need to double him. In fact, if we if we hit him really hard, he's just gonna get healed by. Although I, I guess what is the purpose of the stride except to like you know. <laughs> get in range of these guys, and so if striding a net, let's Ooh, just move Felix in. You know? True. I guess it would also allow the mages to come closer. Uh, we can leave Byleth to this Pegasus Knight for a little bit, I guess, and mm -hmm. have everyone else help over here. 
and that would allow the other ones to join in on the Raphael slaughtering fund. Oh, true. I guess, yeah, turn-wise. I guess the question is, what do we do with these people? Um, if we were to stride, for example, Constance could probably finish Leone. 33. Uh, yeah, we can definitely finish Oh, yeah, easy. Yeah, I think even Happy can do it, actually, without a stride even, so I can check that. Yes, that will work. Probably nice. want to heal Baltus with her instead, thinking about it. Yeah, but Baltus being at 1 HP is actually, like, you know, not great, because he kind of does need to tank a bit. Yeah. Well, not right now. But I guess he, he can, like, run somewhere in Vaughn. We'll see. Mm hmm. I think the main difficulty is going to be finishing off all three of these units without getting murked by Hilda. Hilda is kind of strong. Um, well, Hilda's range doesn't actually, like, cover any of our squares, right? I think right now she's actually just trying to go back and, like, assassinate the mages. I think that's her target right now. <laughs> Uh, she looks for the most vulnerable target, right? Like her favorite target, so that's yeah. fair. Uh, I think, I mean, at the very least she can reach Leone's square, so if we want to one-range this calf, for example, we want to do it with Dimitri, so he can canto away. Oh, true. Which, one, two, how much does calf impede? Uh, get impeded by stairs again? Like Stair is three. Three. We have seven. So, wait, if it's three, how come he can get all the way here? Oh, this is, this floor is made of floor, might be... Only this is stairs. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so this is actually floor. This is stairs. Okay, so this, it's stairs, floor, stairs. Okay, that makes it a lot easier. So I know Dimitri cannot one-shot calves without, like, Nightmare of Lance of Ruin, but that's an option we have to just kill that guy. So Dimitri's mm -hmm. going to do that, but then who's going to get Ignaz out of the way? Uh, Felix? No, Felix is probably going to go north, right? I guess Yeah, Felix the is going north for... We did weaken him. Hmm. Uh, he's got 34 total magical one-shot bulk, so... Ooh, oh, uh, she can get there with Sagitte. Okay. Okay. So possibly Constance here, Dimitri back and forth, this Cav, Happy or someone else who has a turn to do it, like Yuri, I don't know, kill Leone. And yeah, because the, the Pegasus is still like locked on Byleth, right? So yes, yes. Just, I don't know why they hate her, hate her so much, but they, they are locked. Yeah. On. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So we do that. You kill that, and Felix gets a rally and starts fighting Raphael. If we rally, gets him, in there. Yeah, I wonder if we can one round him with a Thunderbrand and a rally speed. That'd be really funny. Oh goodness, win. that'd be funny. Yeah, he's gonna get like basically like plus five speed from this, right? From this rally. So Does he catch a rally res as well for like you know fighting like Scythia and Marianne? Yeah, I mean, Ned like, has that too, right? So, yeah, Ned has it. Relevant, holy. <laughs> yeah, I mean, do you want to like equip a bow then? Um, to kill the Scythia on the same turn. I don't know if he'd live Raphael plus that Scythia. That seems like a lot to ask. Like, what's it? What's his bow like do right now? Like, if we did Iron Bow, this Iron... is how much exactly? Uh, I guess I can't see. <laughs> it's the blister range. So he's got twenty nine. Yeah, attack. it's a lot. Twenty nine. Uh, oh yeah, forget about it, dude. Yeah, it's not happening. We don't have to kill him. It would be it would be okay to have like Scythia killed here, just so that she doesn't. Uh, don't have to do it next turn, basically. Yeah, yeah. Uh, we but... could also just like, you know, let her attack. Like, we probably live one. You know. You mean like use the Thunderbrand to kill Raphael instead of Lysithia? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's possibly fine. I actually wonder if you could tank that. Uh, so 36 attack with Miasma. Uh, oh boy, <laughs> that's a lot of damage. Uh, yeah. It's right now 36 is 31. Rally Res will make it 27 damage. So we're down to 14 HP. I think Raphael kills us. Mm -hmm. What's our speed right now with the Thunderbrand? 20. It goes down a bit. Dang. Should, should make it 25, right? Yeah, 25. I'm that's wondering that's how much weight allowance we have and if we can fit the talisman shield in here, but I don't think we can. Oh, that'd be so. really funny. Uh, well, right now we have weight minus three. Uh, weight minus three is like total weight reduction, right? Like it's just like minus yes. three after everything combined. So, mm -hmm. talisman shield is four, right? So it probably isn't happening right now. With weight minus three, we're reducing to four. Yeah, we exactly, almost exactly, just get the thunderbrand weight negated, but not a whole lot more. Like a little bit of yeah, running no. error there. And do we even kill Raphael with the Thunderbrand? 35, 20. I don't think well, we it's uh, 39, right? Because we get Rally Strength? Or... Yes, 39. Did you include that? I did not. You're right. 18, 18, 18, 18. That kills. Well, enemy phase. That's perfect, so actually. Would... Enemy phase wouldn't kill. Oh, oh, I see what you mean. I see what you mean. Yeah. Um... yeah. I think if we both have brave weapons, I want to be the one attacking him. So. Yeah. So maybe actually, is there a way to like fight us to kill but not Raphael? No, right? I don't think so. Uh, Raphael's like just that much more move. 
Uh, oh god, the camera's reversed here, not here. Oh no. <laughs> okay, so yeah, Raphael's way more reach. Mm, well, I guess pulling Raphael's the main goal here, so we can just like just fight Raphael. It sounds like that's just the way to go. Mm -hmm. Allow me to stride, 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 and straight. Allow me to stride. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I guess the other question is: Is Raphael gonna gambit us? I didn't think about oh, that. Oh, true. I wonder what he wants to do. Oh, hello. What, is that a short axe you got there? Steel axe. What are you trying to do, friend? Oh, oh just, he can just run up there. Oh, I guess he just has the movement. Yeah, this wasteland. Okay, all right. I mean, he could probably tank it. Probably. I didn't check. Oh, right. We can't even, like, attack him on player phase anyway. So, like, never mind. You mean this turn? No. <laughs> that, yeah, this turn. That was okay. never happening, I'm afraid. Uh, we got to rally him. Yeah, yeah, I, I was somehow thinking we could, and I was like, oh man, let's run up and like bam, 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 like destroy Raphael. But oh, no, yeah, no, like, that was, that was if that can't right. happen, then. I can I can no. blister him, but uh, that's about it. it uh... Oh, he doesn't want to attack me. I guess Who is go... first, Raphael or uh, Lysithia, actually? I want to say it's Raphael, but that's from memory, I'm not sure. We can, like, the unit list is actually really easy to check because their names are there, right? Oh, true. Um, I didn't think this was an option, but it is. Hmm. I guess that guy's actually, like, kind of important. But I don't really want a longbow. Do I have a spare action to trade someone here? Yes. Uh, oh, Happy can go up there. No, Happy was gonna attack someone, right? Was I she? I think she was gonna attack uh, Hilda. Not Hilda. Uh, Leonie. Leone, yeah. Can you kill Leonie? I guess maybe um, Furry has a turn to spare. Yeah, he's not doing shit this turn, so maybe uh, he can be the one that trades Felix to something else after he longbows that. Uh, like... Actually, what am I talking about? I can curve shot. Yeah, curve shot Ironbow. Uh, what about actually? What about curve shot Longbow inside Lysithia's range? This is kind of why I'm wondering if Raf if Raphael moves first because if he does, then maybe he like doesn't attack Felix and does attack the Empire, and then Lysithia is like baited to attacking. Does the Empire Felix. move before the Alliance? Yes, the Empire moves first. Oh, well, we kind of want Raphael to come here, don't we? Oh, true. With the bow out, he does move towards us. But like, if we if we have a weapon, uh, Raphael is going to the Empire. It's Kind of unfortunate, but is the reality. You think he's only going to go for us if you don't counterattack? I think so. Mm -hmm. I guess there's. This might be a good reason range. to do it then. Mm -hmm. I guess not. I guess the reason is that we killed this calf, and uh, he's in a good position to fight the mage on the enemy phase afterwards. I guess I don't know. Uh, sure. How's uh how's Byleth do against the what's it called the the Pegasus? Uh, same as Can before. we like Kanto all the way up or no? Uh, do you want to like mounts and I just like shoot and then canto a little bit up, I guess? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, gosh, the bow's kind of like garbo though. <laughs> don't we have an ironbow plus in convoy we can use instead? I don't think so. We do. Based. Found it. So you want to like curve shot with that and then move up and see what happens, I guess? I guess, if it, I don't know. It doesn't really change anything about the top right. But we can do it. Sure, sure. Uh, what? Oh, she doesn't have curve. Yeah, we don't. Yeah, yeah, we don't have D. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Yeah. But the stuffs have like plus a crap ton of extra hit, so I don't mind doing it. Ooh. And now we can. What we can do now is we can actually position ourselves to uh, either get attacked by Raphael or just have a place for like Felix to trade stuff over. If we uh, need. So we're gonna have to bait Raphael. Oh yeah, that could happen. Uh, oh, I guess you want to have Felix get what other convoy? A shield? You know, I don't actually remember. Um, <laughs> um, oh, 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 yeah, it, it was a shield. It was a shield. Okay. And yeah, I think like if Felix gets fight like Lysithia with it. Uh, no, I, he would still be fighting Raphael, but like he's getting attacked by Raphael. So. Oh, okay. So the idea is that he just unequips his weapon and takes up shield. Yeah. So like northwest of this square, and then uh, Felix like uses shield and iron bow to fight this cav. Okay. But then he has a bow equipped. Yeah, but which which is necessary for Raphael to attack us, right? No, the, he has close counter, right? Does it? If we Felix equip the bow and move in, oh, let's sit wait right here. Uh, in any case, I kind of want to like see the Raphael's indicator. So right now he's going here. Well, yeah, he has no empire range. Yeah. Wait, does he? He doesn't. Not this turn. It's after the empire moves that he has him in range. Oh, you're totally right. Hold up. Okay, yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Let's get like shield and uh, iron bow plus, I guess. So you want the talisman shield? Uh, 
Oh, yeah, sure, I guess ball. actually. Oh wait, hold on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Options. I guess we don't need steel bow. I forgot that I had like a whole bunch of more equipment that I might want to give to someone. Um, yeah, maybe. Uh, these are we don't need the... longbow ever, right? I guess not. So you want to get like uh, an iron shield as well then? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That or the talisman. Well, you have both now, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, we have the accuracy. It might be. That's good. We'll take 11 by 2 here. I think that's fine. For Raphael? Yeah, for Raphael. Curved shots. Yeah. The talisman shield is like, so funny looking, I always feel. It's like this little round thing, but it has as much pro as a big old iron shield. <laughs> yep, he's down. Okay. For now. 10 by 2. I think he's still nice. just going to kill a mage up here, right? Like, there's no way he's going to fall for it. Hmm, maybe. I don't actually know if the mages move before, like, getting provoked here. Monk wasn't with you. Hmm. Well, the AI, the, the wiki knows it's like two turns after the golden deer start moving, they start moving, I think, is their AI. Hmm. Anyway. Uh, I think it was Constance who had to finish this guy off. Sounds yes, I think that's right. Goodbye, Big Knots. Sorry you forgot your glasses. And... Oh, Yuri can still do a trade here if we want to. Wait, hold on. Can Balthus attack that archer? Balthus? Oh, this yeah. archer. Uh, wrong, wrong Balthus. I mean, he's gonna die, right? But No, no, no. From melee. Oh. It's out of his range of Hilda, apparently. So that, that's it's out of range of everyone else, right? Yeah, it's, it's a, he can sneakily assassinate this mage. There you go. I think we leave Thief him here Balthus. for now for some uh, link attacking, and then we peace out. Yes, perfect, perfect. So, uh, is it happy? And then Dimitri th takes it to Cav, I think, was the idea. Yeah. Yeah, Yuri at this point does need to actually attack the Pegasus, though. Does he? Well, because Byleth oh, is out of range, yeah. yeah. That's true. Well, that's not going to kill. Uh, actually, it is. I, I lied. With a bow? Yeah, he's, he's going to kill. Don't worry, don't worry. I lied. Oh, what? Uh, From two ranges, yeah. more accurate. So it'd be like 94. I was being greedy. Yeah, yeah. All right, Yuri's now relevant for the rest of the chapter, probably. Probably, yeah. He's going to just be like marooned down here until it's time to steal. I guess this is an argument for deploying flame in this chapter. To, uh, oh, rescue. for the rescue? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> ah. <laughs> ah. <laughs> All right. Uh, I guess there is a calf here that can attack him. No, wait, Dimitri's going to nuke that guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I think we have to do this. Oh, Night yeah. near, near the Lance of Ruin, right? Yeah, basically. Uh, got a hit, Holy. I guess. 60? Sure. Boom. Never had a oh, I guess... Yeah, uh, these are stairs, so we do kind of canto, like, unfavorably here. Oh, I should have moved one down instead. Oh, one left. Started. Cringe. Uh, yeah, Hilda's gonna, like, wreck me now. Uh, I guess he lives, Hilda. Actually, if you go full south, aren't you out of her range? Uh, I guess I am, and I'm off the stairs. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine for me. That's funny, yeah. I like that. That's <laughs> sure. actually a, the best place for him to be, probably. Yeah, like, anyway, yeah. <laughs> Get him, Balthus. <laughs> okay, good turn. Took us a while. Took us a while. Yeah, very very aggressive. Very good. Okay, Caspar's going in. Raphael, so come here. Raphael prefer? Come here, Raphael. Have food. Ooh. Oh, they're staying out of range? They're smart, smart mages? Come here. Okay. No, come here. No, no, no. Okay, Caspar lives. The fellas. Uh, Okay, let's hit the uh, chill. <laughs> Damn. Wait. Oh yeah, yeah. Extra range. There we go. <laughs> Damn. Okay, Hilda. All right. I see you. I see you. See what you're trying to do. I'm trying to get to my Dorothea. It's not happening though. Can't blame her. Hmm. Okay. So. I wonder. There's no way Yuri can like one v one Hilda, right? She's way too strong. Thirty-seven. Yeah, with 10. the. If he's if he's attacking, he does double. If he's kind of like standing still, though, it's like a dead even fight. <laughs> well, kind of. My initial thought was to like bait her with short axe with the iron bow and then go up close with the wind sweep, maybe. But mm. after that, I don't know what's happening after that. <laughs> what's uh? How much attack does he have with say the gauntlets? Gauntlets. Doing a nasty. 
22. 22. Actually, 25 because of the personal, yes. right? Yes. So 25 uh, versus 20 times four. We're, are we quadrupling? We are quadrupling. Yeah, it'll be it would be 36 if he had the rally, but he probably just don't have the rally. Mm -hmm. I mean, we could always uh, spend his blaze on Hilda, I guess, to freeze her and counterattack with a good weapon, and then finish oh, her off. Oh, that's true. That might work. And we can dedicate Dimitri to other things. Yeah, I'd kind of like to get Dimitri like activated in the north here. Mm -hmm. That seems a bit... Move our knight to a better position. Oh, true. Uh -huh. We can, like, run in here and just kind of thump by Scythia, right? Can't we? For sure, there's a way to do that. Felix is already beating up all the girls, so... Can you get Whoa. Here? Look. Okay. It's a war game. It's going to happen sometimes. Sure, sure. Right. Ooh. We're going kind of fast, right? Kind of I think fast. 12. Kind of, Holy. Kind of, Wait, how much speed does Violet have? Uh, 17. 15 with the bow? Come on. There you go. Surely. Oh, there's like gauntlets, 15. I guess. Nah, she's 14 when dismounted. Where's my Annette? Oh, here. So we can rally Violet to get uh, 19. Mm -hmm. The kill. I don't want to go in this range because I think these guys are like literally super easy to just keep stationary by not going in her range. Yeah, if you just they they, they never like move on their own. Mm -hmm. They never think for themselves. <laughs> they dumb. We can. If Felix kills Marianne. Uh, Byleth can gambit Raphael and Lysithia once, can't he? Yeah, she can. Uh, no, wait, she can't. She has uh, zeros. Yeah, she has the two. Hmm. Well, I guess she can she can gambit these two with a... Uh, nah, it's not happening. That's the wrong move. We can, like, assembly Lysithia and then, like... <laughs> you know. Nah, that seems kind of weak. Yeah, no, she it's ends like two up in people, a bad just... spot. Yeah, she oh, does, we just one-shot Lysithia. Yeah, she does get I destroyed, she... though. It's pretty funny. Yeah. Maybe uh, Felix kills Marianne and then Byleth cantos backwards after destroying her with assembly? After destroying Lysithia with assembly? Yeah, because uh, we could use the space here that my Aaron is currently on to Canto to stand on and then Canto one back. I guess it doesn't matter. You can also do that from here. Mm -hmm. um, and we, we won't be in range of anything, so we just rely on the Empire to just destroy Raphael here. Surely. They don't have any kills yet, so it would be pretty good, I think. Yeah, by their powers combined, they yeah. can take out Raphael. Yeah, Probably. sure. I like it. That's pretty safe. So what's this? Uh, Marianne does have Miracle, I believe. So oh. we need to... I, I, I believe. Attacks, I don't actually right? know. Yeah, we have enough attacks to get rid of Miracle. Yeah, we, okay. We've got, actually, Miracle can't even proc because we put her at 34. Or we do 34. So. <laughs> true. I mean, if we if we proc Cresta Fordari, she could proc Miracle. Oh, true. Yes. Mm -hmm. That can happen. Um, we can rally mm -hmm. Felix to like increase his accuracy or... There's, we, no, there's no like good rally square though is the issue, right? Yeah, not no. If Violet has to move second, then you're right. That actually isn't there. Or yes. wait, aren't we like only going to be in range of a mage? No, the brigand has range on us too on that square. Doesn't yeah, it? that guy runs up to us mm -hmm. hella fast. I think we can rally Violet, I guess, for extra. Does it even do anything for an, for a gap? But not really, right? Wait, if she kills, she can just canto on Lysithia Square anyway, right? Because Lysithia Square will be vacant. Yeah, true. And Raphael moved after the Empire, so actually that's probably correct. We we'll just do it first. Do we heal Byleth first, though? Yeah, maybe. She's going to be kind of in a no man's land for a bit. I'm thinking if we rally strength, we can just kill with Rast Strike. We don't even need to use our assembly. Oh, true. Do yeah. we need to rally strength for um, Felix, though? Uh, we don't have to, right? Because we do we have a guaranteed kill on her. Like, I think it's. As long as we assume that we hit a 92s. Yeah, I'm a little bit concerned about the say crit, but also we have Divine Pulses, right? So. Yeah. I think Nasratu will heal like 10 or 9. But it doesn't matter. Like either way, if she procs miracle on the third hit, we kill on the fourth. Yes. Um, or we crest of Altarius, Yeah. <laughs> if we use Bynath first, I think we physic Baltus and heal Bynath with Constance or Wart is actually pretty good here too. No, we don't even counter. It doesn't matter. Just yeah, yeah. No, just nobody's taking a counter. Heal. Can we heal Baltus? Oh, that's probably wants to heal more. But this puts her. Uh, uh, 20 physics remaining. A lot, okay. Yeah, several. Physique. Thanks, Bill. Thanks, Bill. Crest of Timotheus. <laughs> Still have five physics. Wait, did we? Nice. Yeah. Based. Uh, heal. Thank you. Rally. Much needed. Rest strike. 
Goodbye. Rat Strike Iron Sword. Take her out. As expected. To dinner. Ha 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 ha. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> nice, nice. You get extra damage from Violet Link. Uh, he does not get damage, but he did get hit, so he went up to 99 from like 92. Wait, what? I don't get it. He would. He went up to 99 hit, but he did not get plus damage. Oh, okay. I thought I saw the uh, like an increase on the attack, but I guess I was wrong. That was from Ingrid. Oh, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Thanks, Ingrid. Appreciate it. Yep, yep. Um, you think they need help from Baltus? Probably right. They're not like the tankiest people ever. Baltus is probably good here. Yeah, probably. I think. Yeah. Uh, Keep healing him, maybe. Cause like, he's he's pretty low still. He's got like 22. 25. Oh uh, gosh. Why did Happy have to level magic? <laughs> <laughs> 25 prod is uh, quite a lot, but not enough to like take zero from these. So I think healing first is better. Just like let him get down from high health, I guess. Yep. Kind of pull him up. And I guess having another person here to kind of one shot people is good, better than gooder than going here and fighting an armor slayer. I mean, he's not armored right now, so I guess it doesn't matter. Yeah, I think Petra's like not moving either, so. Yeah, it's. Uh, I mean, I think she would move after we aggroed the Golden Deer, which we did, right? But uh, hasn't mm -hmm. happened yet. I think the question is whether or not we need these guys down south for Hilda, but I don't mm. actually think so, because I think we can just run north and kind of. Yeah, I think Petra joins these guys, probably. Could have owned, I guess. And just see if these two can take care of Hilda. Uh, Dorothy has Thoron for three range, so she can safely get a 26 attack chip on her. It's pretty good. Oh, true. It's a good start. Mm -hmm. I think we want to like not take damage initially and just uh, start with just like standing outside of range. Or do you want to like get a bow attack on her? With the short uh, our Iron Bow counter attack is like pretty pitiful. I feel so. I don't like. It's seven damage. I guess we could. Do you think Thoron plus um, Gauntlet's kills? The gauntlets are 20, right? So... It was 20-something. Like, 28? So do we have 40 attack with Thoron? <laughs> do not see Maybe we not. do. Okay, yeah, no. A bit, yeah. a bit out. If she was enemy Dorothy, yeah, maybe she would. Maybe, yeah. Uh, 25 with attack, the boost. actually. That was what I was thinking of. Yeah, we have 7 times 4, so 28. So down to 22. So... Now I'm wondering if I can make up the difference somehow. What if I used 11 sword to counter attack? Would that be terrible? Wait, what, do you have a rally strength from uh, Annette that can target a square that? Oh no, dang it! Annette's like way far out. Maybe we do send a do here then. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I think this this combination of units will get it. Yeah. I mean, this is like the do's ideal scenario. It's like being up against one really strong opponent. Bye, Raphael. Yes. <laughs> See you. Stat boost. Still no stat boost for them. That's their first kill. Yeah. I mean, that means the mega zero, right? Because like they're never gonna get an opportunity to fight each other anymore. Yeah, we're, we've like we won completely put ourselves between them. Yeah. Base. Uh, vengeance. Ooh. See about that explode. Pushing chip damage for free. I mean, free. I mean, taking a bunch of damage, but he's gonna get his XP somehow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We can't just have no Yuri. <laughs> exactly. Thoron! So, uh, about that rally charm that we worked so hard for. <laughs> Maybe it's just the way I play, but I just haven't found rally charm very useful yet. Maybe the day will come. Our units were kind of good to be, we're like pretty good, so, uh -huh. you know. It's definitely a very like punch above your weight class type of ability, I won't lie. Uh -huh. You're right. Okay. Actually, okay. that is plus one attack, plus one hit, to be fair. Uh, what? Um, you got plus one attack, you got HP one. <laughs> right? <laughs> true, 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 true. Okay. Um, so they're kind of overlapping in an awkward way, I think. Mm -hmm. I might have to pull back a little bit, but I can't pull back into their archer range. So maybe we can try for these two mages and that's it. Actually, what's, like that's the, what's the global range? Yes. Yeah, Felix is kind of, you know... Cooked. Enveloped in range right now. Mm hmm. Look at the bottom one. This is Dorothea's replacement, I think. Yes, that one is. I keep thinking he's an archer. You can just attack from three range. He doesn't one round them. Doesn't one round Dora Northia? Not not Northia. Northia, yeah, I don't know. With Gauntlets, he probably does, right? Uh, yeah, but 
then what? Then he dies, right? I guess maybe if he tanks Hubert and Byleth kills that one and this one can't reach, then yeah, we have something going here. Yeah, we should be able to, I think. No, not Baltus Chill. Oh god, let's Baltus maybe in this? Oh, he, because he could, he'll clear him from He's out of king grappling range, kind of. Diamond Axe? Yo, diamond? No diamond. way. <laughs> World's first Diamond Axe usage? <laughs> if he tanks these guys, it's actually a viable option, I think. But they are pretty strong. 33, 33. Yeah, they're kind of big. I mean, we have two mages who can like attack brigands, right? Don't we? Uh, I suppose we do. Constance has plus three defense. It matters. Trust. Uh, we because we have mages, but one of them can attack. Hmm. Does Annette have drawback or no? She does not. She doesn't even have the mage class. She yet. does. <laughs> oh, she does. That did some on class. Yeah, she does it. Okay. Oh, we draw um, back passes after she attacks and bring in. Oh, we draw back happy so she can bring. No, wait. How does it work? We uh, draw back happy and then we attack at two and then Constance attacks at one and gets the kill. Back from one, you say? Oh, sure about that. Um, you got a point. If only we had Lawrence, we would have had Thursus by now. Ah! This is this is Lawrence's fault, to be fair. This is it's always Lawrence's fault by default. Default? Okay. No, well, Lawrence's fault. Okay, next next idea. Um, Baltus is healed for a bunch of HP, and suddenly mm -hmm. he now no longer dies to Axe Fighters. Let's check that. Thirty-three. Still, it's still Baltus. He still got. 19 prot and doesn't get doubled, so it's like 14 damage each. That's not too bad, mm -hmm. right? What if Constance like lands a gambit on the brigand? That's basically like killing. Okay, what? does Constance take a brigand? That's one. That's one question. Oh, about that. Where's my rally charm? Oh. Um, mm -hmm. Oh yeah, we've made a good call here. Uh, so 33 attack, and yeah, she tanks it right by one. I'm not wrong. I think, I think this, so. This is already factored in. Oh, she has one more prot too. So 36 doesn't get prot. doubled, right? Uh, so we got 8 AS, they got 14, so... No, we got 9, never mind, I'm wrong. Okay, we don't get doubled, so I guess we can check for the group eyes. Or whatever this is, yeah. Yeah, the... Just like a complete, like, shitter group ice, but like, yeah, sure. Kind of. I feel like the Baltus plan is better odds. I mean, he does have to hit Hubert with a 64 diamond axe, to be fair. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, they both have to kind of land one cringe attack, but hey. Yeah. What can I... you do? I guess the other problem is that uh, Baltus cannot heal himself, so we'd have to physic him and then see how much HP he has. So it goes up to 39. That should be enough to take two. Yeah, that's definitely enough to take two Axe Fighters. Yeah, yeah, He's yeah. He's got better odds than He'll the, be fine. He'll be the fine. Diamond Axe. So I guess I'll move Happy. That's, that's, the, that's the least likely thing to work here, right? It's the, it's the Diamond Axe on Hubert. So I guess yeah, I'll take yeah. that first. So do we put Happy here? Happy, I'm pretty sure does die to Brigands. Like, Constance doesn't, but Happy does. Yeah, so. but the idea is that we put Constance ahead of Happy, right? No, wait. Oh, you're right. I see what you mean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold up. Because this guy's not dying. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they can't be in range. So Happy has to go up to do this. Okay. So let's see if we hit the Diamond Axe, I guess, and then the Divine Pulse if we don't. Think of a new plan. Could have been better. Could have been worse. What's even, like, the parameters on Diamond Axe? Is it, like, plus might, minus hit? Or, I know, I've never used this before. I just saw plus 20. I've never used this in my life, yeah. Hit minus okay, 20. That's, it should be your funny, favorite skill because you hate hit, hit, hit plus 20, right? Right, right, right. Oh, you're going right. the wrong way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, true, true. Yeah, this is my. I, I need to get 100 with this one day and be like, hit plus 20 sucks. There we go. <laughs> Diamond Axe. Crest of Cavalry. Oh, yeah. Goodbye. Oh, yeah. Full heal. You no coward. <laughs> okay, so we're getting hit for 14 here. We can even bait this towards Constance and Appy if we want to. It's kind of funny. <laughs> okay, all right. And now we just uh, Gauntlet's one and Bilet the other one. Even if Bilet doesn't kill, we just Gambit. Uh, does this guy have like a million charm? Oh, we can Gambit Storthian. them both, actually. Based. Ooh. Uh, no, we can't Gambit them both because I don't have Assault Troop. I need that set of Battalion. I know. Bilet without Assault Troop? Who yeah. could imagine? I know, right? Uh, I guess if Felix goes above, we get a Gambit boost. Mm -hmm. And Felix can get attacked, but who cares, right? Right? Actually, I kind of care. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, let me just do this. Get punched. Oh, I Wait, why did I... Oh, I didn't do from below, so it wouldn't be a range. Right, 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 right. Yeah, okay. yeah. Stronger, huh? we'll, see. we'll see. I realize Dimitri hasn't, like, tanked a single attack. Yeah, <laughs> <Soldiers. laughs> we put him up all the way here for <laughs> Duskrip Boys, and he hasn't done anything. 
Yeah, like our infantry have gotten in, but like our, our cav hasn't somehow, so. Yeah. We'll like strode the infantry, yeah, and then Dimitri just got entangled with the stairs. <laughs> Didn't even work. I mean, he did like kill a cavalier that we really have to kill. And that's, that's true. Kind of it. Okay. Uh, oh, we can hit Baltus from here. Kind of inconvenience, but uh, I didn't think of that. Where's my hand axe now, huh? True. Wait, a net kill? A net kill? Exclamation point? Based. Simple. So good. So easy. It's that shrimple. <laughs> Bye. Oh, we could have like traded Balthus to Rapier and like killed in melee. Dang. Uh, what? I don't know if we double the guy now. Do we double the brigand on counter? Probably not. Um, oh, oh, we do. From 15 to 9. No way. Get out of here. All right, base. And thief kind of good. Yeah. Good start. Good start. I'll just keep warding people, I guess. I know you. As a reward. <laughs> This really was like the Felix and Balthus show, you know, really? same as all the other chapters, but like, you know. <laughs> really? Oh, he's leaving them at perfect chip threshold, too. Look at this. He's so good. He's so strong. Balthus to Jagan. 17. Dude, chill. I don't... Oh, he's ready for um, Fortress Knight, I think. Already, right? Ranks wise? I oh, is he with like armor? Oh, true. Oh, okay. Linhart? Okay. I guess we aggro. Linhart from downtown. Yeah, Holy. Linhart from downtown. Oh, Dorothea, don't go next to the do, whatever you do. Oh, yeah, no, keep them far apart. Uh. Okay, so this can go to whomever's. This is really all we have remaining is Petra and friends? Damn. Yeah, it's Damn just flies. these, like, seven units. Mm -hmm. <laughs> or eight, nine? Uh, I forgot Linhart. I feel like someone got a prioritize for XP. I guess we're trying uh, to rush it? Baltus to 20, I guess. Yeah, it would probably be like either Balthus or Byleth, I think. Yeah. I don't know. Guess we can get the chest with Felix. Sure. Oh, we need to steal from the lords with uh, Felix, actually. I get that yeah. Ring. And this, I think we uh, do need the rally speed for that eventually. Do we like get ourselves in range of Edelgard now? We could like have her to range Dimitri or something. I don't know. Uh, yeah. I mean, that's we gotta have that classic matchup, right? True. I'm they have dialogue and everything. Yeah. Uh, she has a short axe, right? So you can like, have like a short spear off. Yep. All right. I'll work on that. And we'll uh, get the net to kill that we promised her. We can actually tank something with Dusker Heavy for once. Sure. Mm -hmm. Finally. <laughs> that worked out. Blue Lion's kind of owning the battle, won't lie. A little bit. A little bit. Yeah. Big Ray and Setup are just like watching from there, like, what the heck? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Who taught these kids how to war? I yeah, know. To be fair, Manuel and Handman were like, we're not going to participate. So, like, I don't know. Sucks to be them. Okay, do you think uh, Petra will move if we aggro Edelgard? Probably, right? I think not, actually. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure. I'm not certain, though. We'll find out. Do you think um, he can tank uh, Petra a little bit? Damn, he... 26 by 2. Just 30 attack or something? A 31? 31. 5 by 2? Yeah. That does work. His bat's kind of, you know, it's in, not keeping up. It's, but... in, it's in bat shape. It's still oh. enough to like, last rush of the battle. <laughs> it's in bad shape. Shut up. You're gonna gambit me, Petra? You wouldn't do that, would you? She would never. You, you double me. You would never do that. I know. She doubles. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. All right. I'm gonna just chill here for a second. Uh, I gotta steal from Edelgard with someone, right? I guess it's someone is. The only thief I have here is Felix, right? Yeah, yeah I, mean, I guess you got Baltus, Baltus but yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Busy. <laughs> like, same person right now, yo. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure Linhart will aggro. Hello. Here she comes. Oh, she's got crit. Oh, she does. She's a little bit of crit. Oh, no! Hunter's oh, she, wait, boom. Hunter's instincts? Yeah, Hunter's boon? <laughs> Cringe. <laughs> she's actually Hunter's booning us, okay. Okay, I mean, that's... First time I've seen that skill be bro. That's a... <laughs> yeah, it's a pretty good way to counter like the low HP skill. Also, Edelgard decided yeah, yeah. to go. Oh, it wasn't in the range. Okay, I'm yeah, bringing yeah. Baltus back because I. I'm... That's cringe. That was cringe. That's funny, yeah. That was Hunter's Boon actually mattering. <laughs> That's really good. Uh, so, how much? That's her personal, right? So, crit, plus right? 15? 20 crit. Hit plus, yeah, crit plus 20 when foes HP under 50. Yeah, That's crazy. She has 27 crit. So, even if I heal, she's not guaranteed to not crit. 
Yeah. Um, maybe we use Byleth here, because she's definitely got more luck, right? And not low HP. Yeah. She yeah, yeah. Luck. Dimitri also we take like 10 by same. 2. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, in fact, if I pull out a shield, I'll be taking less. Um, sure. Our shield collection? Yep. From the Sylvain Parallel? I guess we got like one shield, right? Like, I don't know. <laughs> okay, sword and shield. Okay, that seems good. Oh. Yep. No, yeah. Yep, yeah. Um, yeah. Yes. Does anyone go yes? I don't think so. Yes. Someone in SOV does, sure, I think. Well. It's Petra time. Here they come. Two crit. Oh, Crystal Flames. More like Crystal Flames, the mouth. What? It does kind of ruin the low HP strats sometimes. Oh, come on, Linhart. Grounder Don't field. Like this. Grounder field. <laughs> All right, give her, give her the sun. She does have the old keen intuition, unfortunately. Oh, that is really annoying. It's less, more avoid if you're attacking her from two range, right? Yes, avoid thirty. Ooh. Disgusting. She's got a lot. I guess we have to take a counter attack then. That's kind of sad. Oh, can we can we double uh, Petra? Oh, no way. Surely we can, right? 23? Oh, mm. we've got it. Do we? If we unequip Talisman Shield. Oh, right. We have a dumb shield equipped after war. Wait, no, this doesn't quite work, so. Dang. Damn. Oh, it's... if we seal speed with Happy, trust me. Oh, <laughs> you're right. We swarm her. Uh, just gotta hit that, I guess. <laughs> yeah, no, I mean, you know, what else are we gonna do with Happy this turn, right? Like, come on. Oh, she's got the extra shield. Surely. Oh, yeah, true. I'm stupid. We're just grinding uh, Mage Rank, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's okay, I was just saying. Let me, let me not make the same mistake twice and actually get the thing. We'll do less damage, but. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll probably do more damage because if we hit because of this, more than zero. Oh, true. It's a lot of hit, a lot of, a lot of like true hit points here, or hit rate, I guess. Yes. Crest of no, no. Uh, can we hit this uh, this person, please? You know what we should have done first is just gambit her. Oh, that would have been funny. Oh, true. <laughs> there we go. Oh, but then we don't double. We just one shot. Come on. Come on, uh... man. Ah. All right, get I'll in there, you. Felix. Oh, Felix works too. That's fine. Or the other guy, yeah. I guess uh, we, we, because we can to technically go. double her now, right? Oh yeah, yeah. So. Technically, we can get a nice little combat forecast. Someone's gonna see Happy there and be like, "You hit her with Swarm. It's unfair." <laughs> no, I didn't. You did. No, I didn't. And even if we had, you know what? I'm gonna double down. Even if we had. <laughs> I have every right to do that. That's right. All right. Do we need to like cowardly wait for the rest, or can Felix do this on his own, or can Dimitri do this on his own? He can do this, right? Surely, Dimitri can do this on his own, right? Uh, what are we taking here? Jesus Christ, you're so strong. Chameleon. What do you, uh, she also has hit plus twenty. When did you start Archer, Edelgard? Tell the class when you started Archer. With that E rank bows. Yeah. <laughs> I know. To you. What I really want to know is how Hanneman managed to put Defiant Strength on Leone. Like, wait a minute. <laughs> I guess he's just like really progressive, you know? He doesn't follow the gender roles. Good on Hanneman. What class is Defiant Strength on? Like Warm Master or something? No, what's it called? It's Hero, yeah. Oh god. It is time to cross blades. I never imagined such a day would come to pass. If the Empire and the Kingdom go to war, we'll be able to fight as much as we please. I'm sorry, but that is not something to joke about. The thought of fighting you is troubling at best. In that case, I wonder when you'll be able to stomach facing me in battle. Do you need a few moments? Let's go. Oh, we're not even at full HP. We're just flexing on her at this point. Yeah, no. Yeah, we did get injured by something. I don't remember what. Mm hmm. Yeah, we didn't think anything. We just took a bunch of damage. Hey, Linhart, please. I'm trying to fight one on one here. I know. What is this, an MMO? <laughs> like, we got the healer in the tank. He's got so much range, too. I know. Uh... This is just Centurion Mystic all over again. I. I... I'm gonna let the audience uh, guess what the fuck that meant. Oh, it was a Slay the Spire one, good. I don't know. Oh, a Slay the Spire, actually? Wait, yeah, I don't yeah, know. Yeah, yeah, uh, There you go. Anyway, yeah, you played that one before. How the fuck is Valtus without any help whatsoever doubling Edelgard? I guess she's just, just, just really slowly gone. She forgot her weight Wait, minus three. Oh, yeah, yeah. You're also, like, you're also accessory bugging some shield off, I'm pretty sure. Oh, never mind. 
The 16 uh, is with Iron Axe. Oh my I, god, you're I just have, fast. I have Holy. no accessories on this man. He, he Wait, fights, you're just fast. He fights barehanded. Okay. I am just Do we have, fast. like, Marchering Felix or anything? Uh, I have Marchering Holy Violet, crap. so I could have Marchering Felix. True. Uh, what do you want to do? Like, quad her with uh, Dimitri, with, uh, with Felix for fun? Oh, that'd be too easy. We could, like, give both the gauntlets and do it as well. Like, you know. Oh, true. <laughs> it's punch Halo Guard in the face. It's like Ash uses to choose your own adventure novel right here. Like, you know, which one do you want to do? <laughs> No, why did you want Marching Felix then, if you didn't want a gauntlet? Well, I did want a gauntlet. <laughs> oh, okay. Alright. Uh, yeah. <laughs> have it your way. Can I borrow that? Oh, we could even rally Dex, because why not? Yeah, Yeah, sure. I, think it's, uh, I mean, it doesn't increase his proc rates or anything. Okay, I'll just take these off of you before you inventory bug. Rally your dexterity. Punch him. Punch her. Excuse me. Bam, 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 bam. Bam, oh. bam, 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 bam. Boom. Boom. Wait, how many Fraud Darius? Yes. <laughs> Sometimes doesn't add damage. Yeah, yeah. Nice, nice. Oh, we need to not forget to cert uh, Ingrid. Yo, can we kill Edelgard with freaking Undead here? Jesus Christ. No way. Oh, wait. Oh. Wait, we have a magic staff on Constance? Um, we do. We also have Rally Magic on her, don't we? Oh, that also, yeah, that too. I have both. This is where I started looking for some like rally strength, like training lance. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> did that flame kill that you did on Edelgard? Oh yeah. Hundred hit. Didn't even need anything. Ha. Aw. Thanks, Annette. I'm sorry, that was totally a waste of a boss kill experience, by the way. <laughs> yeah, no. Didn't even get like uh, professor guidance. Sad. I don't know. Why don't you come like fight me over here if you're so brave? Okay, how about, let's see, can Yuri steal from Claude? Oh, we forgot to steal, hold up. Oh, oh crap, yeah, that, so is, right. that is important, actually. Oh, like, uh, yeah, 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 um, before Felix's attack dealt 39 damage to Edelgard, we probably need to steal. Yeah, okay, we probably need to do di different damage. Oh, okay. uh, you can we have a, uh, yeah. Wait, where's our steal? Uh, full inventory, maybe? Or is he just too slow? He's too slow right now, 21, 21. Oh, God. We do need the rally speed, it looks like. Uh. Uh. Oh, he's got space, okay. So uh, I'm gonna need that, actually. Yeah, give me that evasion ring. Accuracy. Or accuracy ring, yeah. rather. Yeah, claws the evasion one. Uh, now I don't have space for him to go other than below, but I guess I can go below. Sure. Stay focused. Sure, pal. And then just eat the hit from Linhart. I don't know how good he is at that. He's got Nosferatu. He's got like Nosferatu. Attack. Wow, so that's 24 attack. 24. Um, Actually, it is enough. That is enough. Uh, Unless we press the Chevalier. No, I'm kidding. Um, <laughs> oh, Rally Res. Oh, Rally Res. Or Ward. Yeah, you're right. Uh, Annette? No, yeah, she's Ward. Like... Oh, Ward. Right, right, right. Ooh. But we're going to take damage from Edelgard, right? How much? Yeah, yeah, yeah. How much? 19. That's a bit much. Oh, we're wait a minute. We, have to heal we also anyway. don't live this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's all right. I guess I'll just like heal to 30. Is that enough? Sure. Hey! It's plus six damage, right? Pretty good. Yes. Okay, so we're taking 25 and then we're dying to Linhart. Not great. Not my favorite thing to do to guys. Maybe we like steal with Felix from south as opposed to from west? Oh, of course we do. Alright, choose your own adventure. Uh, rewind. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, equip bow, I guess, in that case. Oh, true. Thank you. There we go. Why, now it works. Why no steel XP? So, wait, did he die from this? He did, right? Yeah. Yeah, we needed a heal. Heal, please. A crate. It means he does less damage. Is that going to be a problem? But it means we take less damage. Uh, well, if she's we survived, like we take a lot for... more damage. Oh, true. Uh, maybe we do need Rapier, actually. I mean, she's not armored, but like. Surely, like, Lance of Ruin Dimitri's got this. I don't even think there's any, like, Lance Breaker here, right? Stay uh, I don't know. Let's find out. Oh, almost there. Uh, don't maybe use it, please. Tempest Lance, Training Lance is better, maybe? Um, So close. Ooh. Wait, do we have, like, an Iron Lance Plus we can get him? Or no? Ooh. I mean, Byleth is available. 
And she has... Wait, where's my lance gone? She had one, right? Uh, one in convoy, I think. Oh, maybe it did. So I don't actually know. Yep, we have some here. Okay, I found it. So that's like slightly stronger than train lance, so we should go with this, right? Okay. Yes, and it should still be accurate enough as well. Okay, Dimitri. It's all down to you. There you go. No pressure. Let's take this iron shield. And go. Tempest lance. Iron lance. Boom. <laughs> Boom. Oh. Should have no trouble winning. Don't give up. <laughs> you saying that to Linhart? Like, get out of yeah. here. <laughs> you should have no trouble winning, Linhart. Linhart's just like, just get it over with. <laughs> Why am I even here? Let me get back to nap time. Like, I don't know. That's my cue. Linhart, come here. Yeah. There is two crit, to be fair. That's true. He had a chance. He just gone lucky. Next time, bring your threat. <laughs> <laughs> Very fitting. Alright, uh, I think we need a lot of speed against him too. So we can send Yuri to get the chest. Yeah, he's got 24 speed. And Felix with Rally gets that, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, we've got it already. Nice. Come over here. Uh, Yuri can go get the chest because it's like something I always forget. Do you heal? Yeah, I gotta get that Keller Lance. Yeah. Heal the Reno's. Yeah. I guess Dorothea can like heal in air quotes, right? Like, you know. Yeah. So this is what the goddess grants me. So this. So this. Okay, you got three range, so can we take two with Felix? Probably right. Twenty seven and poison strike. Uh this is my Felix. Twenty seven is ten damage each. Should be fine. Should be good. So that's what they're trying to do all along. Uh keep Dorothea away from these people. Get another Vengeance bot in here. Get a Rally in here. Yep. Yep in here. Yeah, we pretty much got it here. <laughs> it's just like stealing the ring and not getting crit by Claude. That's like all we gotta do. Yeah. So We got some Divine Pulses for that purpose. True, true. Uh, she's within one space, right? Yeah. Yes, yes. It's not... Who was the... Was it Azura? Who was two spaces? Yeah. There's probably some other as well that I'm not remembering right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah Seedol yeah. maybe. Get a lance available. Uh, Felix is at full. Uh, Rally, I guess. Rally, maybe he can like do it from the woods. Um, so. These woods, yeah. Sure. I might one. try to take it, but it's okay. Uh, get some accuracy ring here. These people are dead. They don't know it yet. is quite funny. You can like item equip the march ring and then move and then item equip some other accessory. It's like, okay, so cool. Nice. <laughs> yep. Thanks. One sec. <laughs> Bring it on. Oh, right. You're not an archer, so you don't counter two range or three range. That's okay. So I have vengeance over here. Actually, we don't have vengeance over here. Oh, no. Everyone missing. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so we can Vengeance 1, Dimitri plus Felix. Oh, Felix will probably just one round from here. Easy peasy. Gauntlets. Yeah, just got him. Gauntlets. Gauntlets. <laughs> the uppercut at the end. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Like, four hit animation combo. Alright, got that one. Everyone's getting magic, what the heck? Yeah. It's a magical experience. Oh, jeez. I didn't even realize it was doubling. <laughs> I was like, I'll set yeah, this up no. for Dimitri. Oh. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, this just kills everything. Moral right. of the story. I gotta give one to do. That's true, that's true, that's true. 55. Oh. Give up. <laughs> He's so blatant. Give All up. Right. All right, time to bait the second Lord of today. I don't think you can make We do it. need to have rally speed and range as well for the steal. Yeah, uh, but that's a net, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, we've we've got it, we've got we've, it, we've got it. Uh, I'm gonna purposely not check cloud skills and just have put my faith in the Dusker boys. Trust me, bro. Is lighter? Yeah, that's well, no prowess though. This is more prowess, I think. Yeah, I think so. Are all prowess critical? 
They're all right. Yeah, all prowesses give the same sev. They give different amounts of like hit and avoid, but they all give the same crit of aid. It's like, oh gosh, it's like five, six, seven, nine, ten. I don't know actually. Ugh. Hey, your royalness. If you promise to let me have the prize, I'll let you take the honor of victory. Do we have a deal? Enough of your foolishness. I. <laughs> Wait a moment. You are trying to anger me, is that it? <laughs> Saw right through me, did you? Well, if there's no deal, I'll just have to win this thing fair and square. I will happily face you here and now. Do not hold back, Claude. Here and now, behind this bush. Uh, Where you have 9 attack and 76 hit. Strong boss. Very scary. Alright, um, let me have the prize actually, Claude. I want the prize. Give me the prize. Oh, you have a full inventory. Prize being the ring. Oh, shoot. Oh, no. I might have to use one of my other characters. Oh, no. Like... I don't know. Looking at all, like, they're all so good. Like, yeah, sure. <laughs> they're all Give so me that. good, yeah. Alright, take that. <laughs> it's like, let me use one of my bad characters. Can't find one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly what was going on. I was like, all these people could be useful in some way. Okay, I'll uh, feed this to like... Oh, Dimitri is like kind of low level. How much... Is... This is just still another 1 FPO, isn't it? Yeah, geez. Yeah, Chill thanks out, to do. dude. Let's hold back a little bit. Okay, don't not, worry, not, not don't worry. Much, not that much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like so all or nothing. <laughs> They're all so good. Okay, just pick one. Ugh. Nice close counter. Don't worry about it. Oh yeah, don't worry about it. We'll never have to repair this battalion. <laughs> <laughs> Could be worse. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, I guess that means that holding back with the do also isn't an option. Yeah, yeah. Right, yeah. We just to do as well. Oh no. Take the hit. Feed the pilot, I guess. Get the professor dialogue. Oh, true. He's like, hey, teach. Hey, teach. Do we have a gambit left? No, we don't. Do we? No. No. So what we use the other one on? What? Uh, I don't remember. Oh, the mage. The we use it one on like wait what? No, oh, we, we didn't. Listen, it was brass strike. Yeah, but did we use the other one on? Huh? I forgot. I for war. I for war. Ah, oh, so close. Dang. We'll get finished blown next time. This is a great chance for combat now. Great chance. Ugh. Yay. Nice, nice. I hate to say it, but it seems we're at a stalemate. Looks like the Golden Deer won't be winning this round. That is the end of this year's Battle of the Eagle and Lion. And the winners are the Blue Lions. We won. Yay. Woo, we did it. We're going to get our blessed lands. I did not think we were going to beat them before they got any stat boosts whatsoever. I always get them, see get them some. See them get yeah, some. Yeah, no. I sometimes see several. <laughs> yeah. I almost always see several maddening. They're so strong. And Raphael is like, oh, killing mages. That's so much fun. Bye, bye, bye. Oh, yeah, yeah. Bonk, bonk. Just one rounding anybody he wants. Okay, I got Edelgard support. That's all I wanted. Mm -hmm. I had a wonderful time today, Professor. Good. Next time, do nice. more. <laughs> I can only call you He was just like tagging people with a Dusker Heavy. He's like, I had a wonderful time. <laughs> okay. I'll like shoot more arrows at you on your day off or something then apparently. <laughs> New chapter save. Okay, if you have time, we can do some quick certifications before we get going. Oh, yeah, yeah. I think we can uh, sort Ingrid into intermediates and maybe Annette's. She has like 65 chance to make it, so... I think that might have to be a reset fest for a little bit because we focus mm -hmm. on like other things besides reason for her. I don't even know if mage is worth it for her. I think her mage and cavalier classes are actually equal, uh, like her chances. Oh, right now, yeah. 5k. That's what we're dealing with. 65% chance. I know, right? Oh, it's tutoring, isn't it? Yeah, it's tutoring first. Okay. Oh, yeah. Uh, this should be quick anyway, because we, we set up yeah. for this. We set up for this. Okay. That's true. We did give us the motivation. Yep. All right. So Dimitri's good on with that. 
He was working on armor stuff, right? Is is the plan to like assert a fortress knight? What's the idea again? He's got, uh, he's got defense. He's got I think it was, 15 defense. I think it was like just weight minus three. Okay. That's all we were doing armor for. Okay. Armor. And then after that, yeah, it's. I don't actually know. Maybe it's like authority until A for Fat Wrath, Fat Vantage. Yeah. That's what I was thinking. That's like so far Bat, away. Fat Vantage comes second, right? Yeah, because you have Bat Wrath already. Mm hmm. Felix. Felix. Let me just check down goals to see what the fuck they were going for. In the yeah, place. yeah. What were they doing? What are y'all doing? Uh, Felix doing Sword Off. I guess he's doing it for Assassin and C rank battalions. Yeah, I think so. Man, he's got C boats. Oh, dang. and that can get to. Um, Enough reason rank to get the mage certification guaranteed, right? With C. Oh, yeah, yeah. So we don't have to worry about that. Uh, you've already got Pegasus Knight ranks, I think. Do you need sea lances? Yeah, I think you need sea lances, actually. Yeah. You'll get it okay. eventually. And. Uh, Yuri's an important one. I guess all the DLC characters are the important ones. Okay. They're they're easy, though. Like, we know what they're doing. Yeah, with yeah. yeah. Those. Should be easy. Yes. And we have four left after one more. So we need to do Felix, I guess. Or swords for assassin certs, I guess. Uh, sure. Or authority D plus doesn't really do anything right now. Yeah, sure. Swords. Yeah, no. Sword. Even even D gauntlets is like kind of cringe. Like nothing really good comes with that. Mm -hmm. I get like the steel gauntlets, but it's probably gonna be like iron gauntlets plus until Fajr Mushti, whenever mm -hmm. that happens. Yeah. Is that high might Fajr Mushti? Yeah, it's seven, the highest of any gauntlet. Pretty good. All right, mm -hmm. keep going for warp. We'll get there one day. One Trust. Day. Ugh, so far away. I have to like bishop on one day. and um, warlock on the other maybe before advanced. Or dark oh, oh, yeah. classes. Oh yeah, we do have Valkyrie actually. Do we have any like riding rank prepared for them? Speaking of which, isn't Constance like level seventeen? We should probably be thinking about advanced class here actually. Probably. Like a little bit. Like a little bit. Yeah. Um. She's like ages away from Warlock. I feel like even though we've been clicking the reason button, it's like actually quite far out. I mean, yeah, because it's B rank, right? That we need like B plus or something. Yeah, yeah. So I mean, we can work on riding or flying. Um, I guess flying is pretty good. Or yeah, flying for Darkfire. Dark yeah. Yeah, pretty pretty natural for her, right? So yeah. I guess we can do the DLC classes first. Mm -hmm. uh, does that mean we Except send him to Warlock? <laughs> yeah. I mean, a lot of people in the comments like War Monk actually. So. It's true. And like, he's already got Fortress Knight though, so we don't have to go War Monk eventually, but maybe it's good to unlock it eventually so that someone else can go Fortress Knight. Because I do think maybe, there's like yeah. a shortage of like good advanced classes to send people on if you want to do like a e different... faith He does, but he has a boon and uh, the same set. Need. Like, what does it take for War Monk anyway? I don't even know. Eh, that's not too bad. Eh, see? It's a, we're, brawl B uh, We don't have a whole lot of Brawl though. <laughs> yeah, no, we don't have a lot of that. Uh... I've seen. I've, I've. I'm. I'll be honest. I've never made a war monk in my life. I have no idea. Like maybe this class actually is good, but mm -hmm. I've just never done it. A lot of people saying it's like good because of. Uh, I think it was brawling avoid and slash easy to search. I actually he's got C brawling. He's pretty close. Yeah, it's, he's uh, like three ranks away, and then seven ranks away or five ranks. So he's like eight ranks away from war monk right now. Yeah, but they're like low ranks. Like it's. it's yeah, it's different. kind of kind of different. Uh, what, what what would he get otherwise? Because. Uh, I think, what is he? He's level seventeen. This is the alternative, which is already—he's already basically there. He's already got a, a, a visible odds of passing, so he's almost there. Yeah, we could do what, this um, first and then work on War Monk, I guess. Yeah, how close is he to something like, say, Hero Assassin or Wyvern, though? Oh, that's pretty good, actually. Yeah, I think we're—it's it's like where Felix and uh, Yuri are competing with him in this one. Probably, yeah, but yeah. It's, it's an option. We also have Swordmasters a spare slot, but that's A rank. That's going to be a while for any of them. Yeah, that's like way far out for everybody. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think the Fortress Knight path first is the best one. So maybe we work on that first. So like just get more axes and armor. Yeah, I agree. Uh, I guess axes we... opens up uh, Wyvern a little bit too. I know Wyvern's obviously like a very competitive class. I don't know if he's going to be in there, but mm -hmm. you know, it does exist. It does exist. I guess it opens up options. You still would still be very tanky unit that we can move far. That's like always valuable to have. Yeah, exactly. Okay, I'll just. Uh, I guess if he's doing like goal, because his goal right now is axe armor. I think right. So we want to do like the least far one. So C plus axes and C armor. Just like make it so that with the goals he hits him like around the same time. Like we don't waste points. Yeah, yeah. So I think. Uh, 
probably axes would be better, so you could try to do like B and C plus. Sure. We got some time. You make a good point. Okay, and Yuri is going for assassin slash hero. I think was it what it was. Like nothing else is going to be working in the short term anyway. I guess. Yeah. No. Eventually, eventually, maybe he has to be in sniper just out of necessity. But oh boy. Oh boy. I know. Sorpo, all right. I guess he did say you're allowed up to one. <laughs> so. I wouldn't mind it. We could have like a sniper on the field and then everyone else like owning. Yeah, sure. Mm -hmm. I could take that. Okay. Here you go. Okay. Uh, wait, not goals. Group tasks. Okay, this is Skywatch for these two. I guess it's an option. I think maybe it might be best to do... Honestly, Skywatch is pretty good for unlocking a Dark Flyer here, and then this is a natural support partner for her, so why not? Yeah. Sure. Uh, but you probably should be working on flying then if we're doing that. Yeah, I wouldn't mind just like B, like just cuz. You know, like B, B Authority, she's right here. She's literally one goal week away from it, right? So, like, I wouldn't mind flying authority? Doing authority. Uh, yeah, yeah, flying authority, pretty good. A flying authority, flying authoritarian. Maybe do like goal. reason for her then, or like a reason writing for her. To get to Valkyrie? Yeah. I forget Valkyrie ranks. Is it BB? BB. BB. Yeah. Double B. Sure. And Boltz is this. This is correct. Uh, he's like... I see a one authority on him. Is it more urgent to go for advanced classes than for him? Like, do Sorbo here? Uh, he He's still a bit far out from advanced classes, I think. So I don't yeah. mind continuing to do authority for a bit. Mm-hmm. The axe does look a bit weird, but I guess our idea, our idea was like hero. We'll leave that open. Mm -hmm. Sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I guess um, maybe it makes more sense to do sword authority then. Yes, I would agree then. Yeah. It's like a point of starting for both like hero and assassin, right? So mm -hmm. kind of opens up the flexibility. Mm -hmm. So if he was working on weight minus three, why is he goaling armor right now? Or why is he goaling axe right now? <laughs> I have no idea. Maybe it was a mistake. Impossible. I don't know what past Mecca was thinking. Yeah, possible. I never make mistakes. Okay. Yeah. So, so sometimes I'll like open up a goal menu from an old file. I'm like, what was I thinking? What dude? was I doing here? <laughs> yeah. Surely I had a plan, right? <laughs> like... Oh wow, she's basically there, but she's so so yeah, far advanced. Maybe we do lances so she can go Pegasus Knight before Wyvern. <laughs> yeah. In the Wait, meantime, can you, can you go straight from? Uh... You can just straight up certify for advanced, can't you? You don't have to do yeah. intermediate. Okay. So maybe. Yeah, you don't need any okay. intermediates. I guess. In that sense, Lance Axes, actually? Sure. <laughs> okay. And Sounds good to me. Somehow she still has D Lances. Like, <laughs> yeah. She's earned, what, like 40 all game? <laughs> yeah, <apparently>. probably. <laughs> she didn't use Lances that much, and I guess uh, we just kind of have been going on other things. Okay. Yeah. But kind of like every combat we looked at, it's like, oh, Rat Strike Sword just kills. I sure. See. Confidently oh. clicked it. That one's pretty good, yeah. I always use Felix. <laughs> I always <laughs> use Felix. <laughs> I know him well. Our boy Ooh, Felix. I see. All right. Honestly, I was hoping for Lawrence there. No. Of course. But now you can't like mash start because it could be Lawrence, right? It could be <laughs> Lawrence. Yeah, exactly. Oh. <gasps> ah. <clears throat> Finally. He's here. I've heard good things about you. I believe your talents may be well suited to working with a student of my uniquely high Bro got destroyed in the house of uh, the Battle of the Houses. He's like, all right, I got to join his oh, other yeah. house. What do you say? Shall we Didn't he kill Baltus? Eh. I suppose when I put it that way, how could you possibly decline? We are a natural fit. I expect only the very best from you, Professor. Yay. Guess who's getting unit reviewed next time? Yep. <laughs> Who does? Linhart. Linhart. By Linhart. Yes, yeah. yeah. <laughs> He's pretty good, but you know, I guess. He is pretty good, but uh, it's been long enough right now. I don't want to put you through more time. Yeah, no. Hey, my spitting stone. Mastery is within my grasp. Yay. It's in my grasp. <laughs> Got it. There's so much left to learn. <laughs> good to go. It's all coming together. Oh, nice. I'm certain I've improved. I think I've got the hang of it. All that studying has paid dividends. Okay, very nice. Very nice, nice, nice. Very nice. 
Ooh. B nice. authority constants. Second unit with B. Based. No supports. Altus. Anyone? Constants. Oh boy. Finally. Above ground or underground? What's with all the ruckus, I wonder? It's above Wait, ground. I am sorry that you opened this support. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, can we get the Ingrid start? Or Pegasus? I think it's 100% now, right? No way. Oh, uh, no, it's not. Okay, I'll save real quick. Come on. There you go. Please, please. Surely, please. right? Cert 40 classes. I worked so hard to not field you. You didn't do anything. <laughs> I think the reason that she got, like, come on, oh. Oh, what garbage. You're cringe, you're cringe. Minus 1,000 gold. You mean reset. Oh, true, yeah. <laughs> Minus two minutes. Plus 1,000 gold. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> Pegasus Knight is hard. It's a difficult exam. But I failed it too. The professor failed it. How, what chance did she have, really? Yeah, no. Pegasus Knight exam, it's hard. So what do you do? Are you, like, giving them the test, though? Like, who, who, who administers the test? Can you just be like, yeah, they pass. I want a Pegasus. Like... <laughs> All right. Mage. Oh, we did want this one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. we did. Yeah, or Mage. Yeah, I really like her uh, Annette's color scheme with the mage outfit. It's really mm -hmm. good. Nice dress. Yeah, like the navy and white. It's very mm -hmm. cool. It's all thanks to hard work. Thank you. I think the reason I think she... it's like sorry, go ahead. Her and Ingrid who have it. it's like just her and Ingrid who have it. I think it's pretty cool. Mm -hmm. What were you saying though? I was gonna say uh, the reason Ingrid has like no land six speeds because every time she doesn't actually she was using an axe for the wyvern. Right? Oh, yeah, for training wyvern. Yeah. yeah. Then you get here like, wait a minute. Yeah. Hold up. <laughs> I forgot I, something. I skipped a step in my process. <laughs> okay. Well, it's probably to be fair. Be... She does have like a crap ton of axe rank, so you yeah. know. <laughs> there, surely there will be a week where Ingrid can start uh, Pegasus and uh, be in that class, and then I guess not much changes until she's on the field again, if she ever is. But... Yeah. True. True. You can, uh, like you said, you can stealth get a wyvern suddenly and use mm -hmm. it. it. Seems fine. And then I guess next time it's optimization time and then maybe into one of the 50,000 paralogs that we have available now. Yeah, no, it's maybe. probably going to be freaking paralog month. We might oh, we're going to get even more too because we can get like Monobola Hanneman. Mm -hmm. Right. Maybe I can set up a preps for Lauren's paralog and then we optimize for a little bit first. Like what, what week do you think we do Lauren's paralog? Probably here, right? We get, probably we get another free um, day after this to before we get to the ring yeah yeah so just those. maybe maybe the way actually is episode optimizing episode lawrence paralog plus uh another paralog or sure um like it depends on like how long we take in a lawrence paralog but i think it would be good to use a date to get two paralogs in either way maybe in over two episodes I think yeah i agree good use of our points that we have Get some, uh, maybe get the Ingrid Dorothea one out of the way. That one's like pretty much free whenever we want to do it. Yeah, it's like it, it's kind of a free win with Dusker Heavy and mm -hmm. like all, all the other stuff we have. Mm -hmm. Oh, we have this. You all we need that one. Oh, true uh, knowledge gem. For Plus knowledge gem, yeah, yeah. Oh, so many options. So many options. Holy shit! It's Forgot like so many good ones. Every, oh, oh, my, oh my this one. This one we're waiting on. This one we're waiting on. Yeah, we need we need Raphael right for uh, Lester. On. Yeah, this one we gotta wait on. This one you can wait on. Oh, we have this one too. Jeez. Oh gosh, cursed relic is so good too. Fetters. Yeah, fetters of Dromiel. Based. Yeah, that one's like so good. Okay, we'll discuss it and more in the very next time. Goodbye. Thanks for watching.